I think. What's up, Neil? <laughs> Aga mo ah. <laughs> Andyan ka na kaagad. Wow, hello. Miss mo ba yung Kina Podcast? Hi, James. Mga ano tayo ah. Old school tayo dito. James, Joshua. Isa na kayo. Uh, I'll start in a few minutes. Pero... Yeah, I'm just fixing some stuff up muna before we actually start. Pero yeah. Uh, hope you guys are excited for today. I'm stoked. Maaga, because nagsa-set up pa ako. Anyway, samahan niyo muna ako mag-set up. May inaayos pa ang mga bagay. Uh, wait lang ah. I'm gonna try to fix stuff first. Tagal ko na kasing hindi ginagawa. So, kinakabahan ako. Mali-mali na yung mga pinipindot ko. Actually, yeah. Waiting for people to come rolling yun. Oo nga eh. I'm waiting na lang din actually. 8.35. Ayan now it's 9. Kasi kinabahan ako, I might not be able to set up properly today. So, ayan. Ayan. Medyo napaga tuloy ako. Uh, hi, Christine Basco, Ariel Pineda, Phoenix. Saan na kayo? Long time. It's been a week since the last time nag-post ako ng video. Nagka-exam kasi ako. Uh, I took, ano, I took GMAT. Yung ano eh. Yung GMAT kasi online. So, inisip ko, kunin ko na. If ever mag-master so, hindi kunin ko na. Sayang naman eh. So, kaya eh, hindi ako nakapag-podcast last week. Sayang din. But I'm happy I'm here, no? Hi, Clarence. Hi, Utakata. Yeah, welcome back. Welcome back, guys. Welcome back. <laughs> Wait lang ha. Balik lang ako, guys. May isa na ako. Be right back in 5 minutes. podcast. Uh, 8.40 pa lang. Pero, uh, usap muna tayo before I actually get into tonight's topic. 9, 9, 9 p.m. pa naman yun. Uh, but, 
uh, for tonight. Uh, are you guys? Been a while, na. Ano ba ta? Ah, hindi sa ko. It's been a week, two weeks, a week into GCQ, no? How is it? How are you guys? Ah, oh, taba ng penguin na yun, ah. How's the exam? Ang hirap. <laughs> Wait, so, ah, uh, share ko lang sa inyo uh, what the questions were like sa exam ko para maliwan na agad kayo on how the questions were. Um, Wait lang, eh. I'm gonna show you guys how it looks like. Son of a I'm gonna show you how it looks like. Bad that. Eh. Um, where are you? So I took this exam last Friday. Uh, Wednesday, that but, but then the move shut to Friday. So I was hoping to do a podcast no last week. As I want to be studying the entire time. So I don't feel if I don't study, I'm going to study. But where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Ayan, yeah, 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 yeah. Found it. So what were the questions like? Say exam. Uh... I took some free, ano eh, I took some free, I took some free tests online. Tapos karamihan look like this. Uh, madali lang yung math portion eh. Uh, eto, eto, eto. So, let me, how do I show this? How do I show this? Okay, let me show this first. Window capture, add source, add new source. Hindi yan. Uh, ita. So, ganito yung itsura ng test na ginagawa ko nun. Literally like this one. <laughs> anyway, uh, prop ko lang para maayos tingnan. So, yan. Ganyan usually yung instruction sa exam ko nun. So, data sufficiency, doon ako sobrang nahi nahirapan, as in, doon ako sobrang nahirapan. Uh, alam niyo yung ano, hindi, ay, yung multiple choice okay lang sa akin eh, A, B, C, D. Pero yung ayaw ko, yung ano, A, B, C, D na true or false pa. So, parang A. Only the first sentence is true is true and the second sentence is false. That was B. Only the second sentence is true and the first sentence is false. C. Both sentences are true but they need each other. Chaka di yung ano, it's sufficient to get from both. Sobrang hassel yun, man. Hassel nun talaga. Tapos, mga questions pa. Kunwari gan yun. Ay! Sana ba yun? Data sufficiency, mababa tayo. Madali lang yung math eh. Madali lang yung math, promise. Pero pagdating dito sa... Ay! Math lang ata ito eh. May yung data sufficiency talaga dun ako na... Ano? Basta ito. Yung mga ganyan. Dun ako sobrang nahirapan. Ugh. Pero besides that, parang okay naman din yung ano. Okay naman din yung... There was an okay exam. Uh, yeah, uh, how's sex? I'm back on shave, yes. Just shaved, literally, before this. Pangit kasi nung balbas ko eh, hindi siya bo. Literal dito lang. Ha, <laughs> pangit. <laughs> uh, what's the main benefit for taking GMAT? It's for masters abroad eh. I only thought of taking it now. Kasi online siya. Normally, it's not online. So you have to go to testing centers tulad ng Ateneo Makati uh, parang yun nga lang alam ko na nag-offer ng GMAT eh. uh, ang aga nasa klase pa ako hindi go yan guys I'm gonna be starting at 9pm so nag-uusap lang naman tayo uh, <coughs> Englit sorry uh, early bird ang kuya Kino eh. o nga eh tata hindi na ako magpaka early 
nasan yung mga dogs? Ah, uh, they're sleeping in another room. Kasi nagkakasakit ako from my allergies. So, inisip ko muna, huwag muna sila matulog sa kwarto ko. Hanggat mag-subside yung allergies ko. Yeah. Ah... Uh, Naglalaro ka ng Among Us. Yes, naglalaro ako ng Among Us. However, ano yan? Yo, Kino, ano masasabi mo na super sikat na, na ng Among Us? I would have liked it na super sikat na yung Among Us. Unfortunately, hindi ko alam eh. Bakit? Ang... Hindi ko alam. I don't know bakit nagkaganon. Na sobrang toxic na ng ano. Uh, environment sa among us. I don't know if uh, we as a people find it funny na nang nagyana tayo, nag umura, I don't know. Ah, ganun. Parang it's taking away from the genuine experience. Parang iniisip ko kasi parang ibang tao natsisayan sa among us talaga na ano, the, 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 the game itself. But then, It's the same thing with the Harvard situation. It was funny for a while. Pero I guess some people just really go overboard with the jokes na nawawala na talaga yung reason why it was funny in the first place. Yung mga ganun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maganda dapat, maganda sana siya, honestly. In yung among us. I don't know if just na-ruin lang talaga yung experience, but... Yeah. Well, I guess it's fun kasi to play with people you know rather than with people you don't know. Kasi ang hirap kaya maglaro with people you don't know. Parang nawawala nga yung thrill nun eh. Anong dinner ko kanina? Uh, tahong. <laughs> tahong. Tahong with rice. <laughs> Yeah, hindi. Masaya naman talaga sa siya. And... work pa ba ako sa Rockwell? At the moment, no. Not at the moment. Uh, I'm working uh, for my mom at the moment. Kasi natatakot siyang lumabas. So, lahat ng responsibilities ng kailangan niya gawin for work. Okay yun sa masalo. So, ayun. Parang ever since nagka-COVID... Parang hindi na nga lumalabas yung mom ko nun eh. Uh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure if it's fresh. Are you from UP or Lasal? I'm from UP. Yeah. Uh, you're a new viewer here dito, no? Jumps? No, nag-resign ka. No, I am currently on sabbatical. <laughs> so, what that means, naka-leave ako for an uh, indefinite period of time. Um, just so I could ano, sort out yung hirap kasi eh hindi makapagtrabaho yung mom ko dahil sa ano COVID nga so hirap kasi eh kapag matatanda kasi lakas na tama ng COVID so work from home kami before though I mean before I went on sabbatical leave nag work from home kami well until now work from home na a skeletal shift so some people are working sa office there right now and some people are working from home pero nung nasa Rockwell pa ako nag work from home ako for a few months before I had to take a sabbatical leave where did I get my mug? it's from my brother yeah kakapasa ko lang yeah hi welcome back Albert Sina bias kasi twice. I don't know if it's pretty obvious already, but it's Sana. Sana, my baby. Iba ang iniinam ko. No, I'm drinking coffee. I wonder if kita niya ba? Kita ba? Kita ba? Anyway, coffee to. Ah, okay, sorry. Hinahin ka na lang yung background music. Actually, I'll be turning it off for the rest of the podcast naman din later. Kailan last mong gala? Everyday ako lumalabas, actually. <laughs> no joke. Parang everyday, landon ako sa risk, COVID risk zone. Eh, kasi, ano, where my mom works, she works uh, near a hospital. So, and then yung businesses niya. Eh, yung karamihan na people we cater to. Food and beverage kasi kami. So, 
Pero mayroon ang people we cater to are healthcare workers, so... Nandun laging risk. So, hindi lang healthcare workers, yun, pati yung mga pasyente that go to the hospital, mga ah, ganun. So... So... Ay, naman, masaya naman ako seeing na napapakain kayo mga healthcare worker. Somehow. Nakakatulong ako sa fight. Somehow. <laughs> Somehow. Ganun. Yeah, mag-ingat tayo. Always wear a mask, though. <laughs> Actually, hagdan talaga yan to nowhere. No? Wala, wala talaga yan. It's not, ano, wala siyang patutunguhan. So, may hagdan, may hagdan lang talaga yan na ginawa ko na ng Shura. <laughs> Matutuloy pa ba yung soon watch party mo? Yes. Pero... Ang bagal ng internet ko guys. As in kapag ninen ano when kapag ninen Netflix ko ayo talaga siyang gumana. As in wala wala talaga choppy siya. Nagse-skip siya every second. So hindi ko alam kung may enjoy niyo yun. I don't know why. If why it's different from YouTube. Na naka ano naman ako ng maayos. Or baka kasi hindi to consumption ng Zoom. Napakataas. I don't know. Yeah. Anyway, so we're 10 minutes away from starting. Um, maybe we could start now. Um, this is gonna be a very simple topic for today. Uh, beyond human, sha. But it's more of a theoretical than a. Yeah, yun eh. Dun talaga yun eh. Yun talaga yung problema ko with Zoom. Taas talaga ng data ko at software. Parang, uh, hirap. Well, not really. Well, it's not gonna be about aliens. Pero it's gonna be about humans. In Discord talaga. Honestly, I, I push for Discord. Kasi it has all the functionalities you would need at the lower cost. Pero hindi kasi naiintindihan ng mga tao ano ba yung price per data consumed na hindi naman kasi yung bad I don't think people understand na may bad ano may limit talaga yung internet na others ano, may bandwidth talaga yun na kinoconsume mo monthly unless unlimited ka talaga pero some most of the companies kasi they limit your bandwidth you skate on ka so paminsan kunwari naka LTE ka tapos nag only ka only only internet ka Paminsan they send you a text. I don't know if you get that. They send you a text na saying na you've been overusing the internet, so we'll be limiting the speed you get. Parang mga ganon. Actually, wala nga nagsasuggest ng site. Eh. Yeah, good luck with sa mga magzoom hassle talaga yun. Anyway, all right, so yeah. You know, it's a globe, yeah. It's a globe. I don't know if it works for PLDT, but I'm sure it's the same as PLDT. Anyway, so, um, welcome to Kino Podcast, everybody in the chat. Um, I'm gonna be starting, nah, actually, because it's a little bit of a nine. What are we going to do now? Alright, so today. Uh, the t- today's topic is called Beyond Human, and I don't know if you guys are wondering why it's Beyond Human. Pero basically, I just wanted to talk about the simple question: What makes us human? Okay. So I've been, ano, ano, uh, working on like different, different um, things that would help us understand it or flesh it out a little bit better. So I found these two games that might be, ano, that might set the mood for us properly. Um, I think companies are using Teams and Google. Na rin. It really depends on the company. Anyway, wait. Kaya na mag-usap tungkol sa Skype-Skype niya na yan. <laughs> anyway, so ayun. Uh, 
So basically, I found these two stories. Story games, yeah. So basically, you just—it's like a movie. You just watch it, and you make your own choices based on the circumstances. So whatever choice you make, it's like a choose your own story, choose your own storybook. Pero parang movie, parang ganon. So the premise is uh, in the future, kasi uh, the humans were able to create robots in the exact likeliness of humans itself so uh they're known as androids and these androids carry the same characteristics as any human being would except uh they're just uh stronger they're smarter they live forever well they don't live forever they have the batteries but aside from that they're exactly like humans so the premise of the at that time kasi, it's that saying na um There comes a time na pre-program nila yung androids to have feelings as well. So, yung kapa- capacity to feel, meron din yung androids. So, it really begs the question, what makes humans humans? ba? Diba? Kasi at the end of the day, if humans were able to create robots na exactly like us, the only difference is they're not born out of the womb. Womb. <laughs> They're not born out of other humans, but they're exactly alike with us, and they exactly feel the same things. They think the same things. What makes them any different, and what makes us special, diba? So that's what we're gonna be tackling about today. Um, there are a lot of ano, there are a lot of themes na makikita natin sa place ano sa story nato. Na I'll be pausing from time to time to ask you guys what you guys think. Um, but it's really more about the morality and the immoralities <laughs> na nangyayari and what what how we should approach it I think ano, I think okay though uh, I think you guys will enjoy I enjoyed it I, well I haven't played it but I enjoyed listening on the the gist of the story so it's gonna be an easy watch you guys just have to watch Um, and then I'll be pausing from time to time, taking taking on the calls uh, from you guys, asking what you guys think of the situation. It's very timely, though. It's very very timely. Because I, parang thinking about it, they just used android robots, na parang as a way to show yung mga social discrimination na nangyayari ngayon, na parang makikita niyo later, kasi na parang Uh, there was this issue people were asking yung mga jobless kasi syempre since mas magagaling yung robots magwork they're smarter they're faster they're more efficient na displacing other people na displacing other humans from their jobs now they're pro- they're protest they're protesting na alisin na lang yung robots from society pero para kasi insura nila talaga humans eh. so If you think about it in today's society, parang there is this elite, ano, there's this elite races that think that uh, minorities are taking their jobs. I would just, I won't say where. Nangyayari to. Well, obviously, sa United States. Uh, paminsan yung ibang mga people there would feel that minorities are taking their jobs and they want them out. So they just, ano, disguise this in the pretense of robots and stuff. Oh, okay. I'll uh, repeat what I'm gonna say. So, what we're gonna do today? Uh, we're gonna be going through the story of Detroit Become Human. So, the topic natin for today is just basically begs the question: What makes us human? Um, nine, pa naman. Well, it's almost nine. Ulitin ko na lang. <laughs> so, for everyone who just joined, and I hope you guys are gonna be excited for this one. Um, well, it's not a movie. It's actually a game, but it's more of a movie. Uh, all you guys have to do is just watch. But along the movie, we're gonna be making our own decisions, which would affect the movie in the long run. Yes, that's how the no, that's how this game works. So, um, yeah, it's really more on the moral decisions that we're gonna be making. Masaya siya, masaya siya, kasi it 
really reflects society nowadays. And I'm excited to discuss it with you guys. This is Detroit on PC. Tingin ng moral. Char! Oh yeah, I, thought, uh, I, I haven't told you guys, but I'm super excited to share this to you. Wait, off ka lang yung ano. Sorry, wait, ito, inexplain ko na to kanina. Sorry, hindi ko na nagawa yung watch party ko. Kasi nag-skip-skip yung Netflix ko. Kapag ano, zinu-zoom ko. Feeling ko kasi kinakain ng zoom yung bandwidth ng internet ko na hindi ko siya ma-stream properly to you guys. Eh, ayaw ko naman gawin siya sa YouTube live kasi makaka-copyright claim ako. So, hindi ko na alam paano. I'm still thinking about it. If pwede siya sa Google Meet or some other, or Discord. Feel ko sa Discord pwede yun eh. At kasi mababa lang dito consumption ng Discord. Anyway, um, we'll start in the game with five minutes. Oh, I, I haven't, nakalimutan ko tuloy yung sasabihin ko. So I've been doing this, ano, this workout routine. Like, <laughs> spoiler na lang for a video. Like, I'm doing this 30, ano, uh, 30 day challenge. I'm on my, for, I've, I've already done one week. So magt- this is gonna be the start of the second week. Day 7 na tao, on the week. My break soon, so it's not exactly 30 days. But I'm excited for that. Because I'm like, whoa, I, I want to... I'm like, I'm jealous because I'm like John T. So John T, kasi, I don't know if you guys follow him on Instagram. But it's beautiful of his face. So, I'm really inspired to do it. Okay, anyway, before we start, CR lang ako. <laughs> Okay, ito na, ito na, ito na. Alright. Uh, Nag-30 days biking challenge ako, 4 hours a day. Kamusta naman yun? Siguro ang hirap nun. Anyway, sige. So, let's start. Actually, let's start. So, I hope you guys stay. Kasi the story is amazing. As in, ang ganda talaga ng story nito. You, you guys won't regret. Yeah. Uh, penge workout. Ah, uh, ito. Fast lang. If hindi nyo kilala. Uh, his name is Chris Heria. Yun yung 30-day challenge na ginagawa ko. Chris Heria, ano siya eh? Uh, YouTuber siya. Who does uh, calisthenic? Ano yun? Body weight as- exercises. Calisthenics yun. Calisthenic workouts. So basically, you could just do this at home. You don't need weights. So... Nagu Google naman yung mga workout niya. You don't have to like watch a YouTube video na susundan mo yung workout na sabay. You just have to look at the. Na. Anyway, anyway, sige, let's start. Let's start. So, um, I hope you guys are excited because I'm excited for this one. And uh, um, even if hindi natin matapis today yung story niya, ito tuloy ko to for, I don't know. A standalone YouTube videos na lang siguro hanggat matapos kayong story just so you guys know what happens in the end so um yan ganda niya no I forgot her name anyway let's start a new story yeah Chris Heria is like a robot talaga yun mukha yung android sa totoo lang so yung ano premise of this ayan yeah. Uh, androids want to coexist with humans because they finally realized how to make use of their feelings. So we're gonna be following three different people na nag intersect yung stories nila. It's a movie game! So basically, we're just gonna be watching but we're gonna be making our own decisions. So makikita nyo... Uh, what decisions I made. Hindi naman ako endorser, pero 
If you guys want a good body, so then you see Chris here, yeah. So make sweet love. Please, please, you gotta save my little girl. So this guy is named Connor, and he's a robot detective. All right, ma'am. He's the very first robot that. detective. You, uh, why aren't you sending a real person? And so the new na makita. Why? Since he's the very first robot detective. For some, ano, for other people, they don't want robots to handle a case, because wala silang empathy. So, what are the assurances na pipili ng robot yung little girl, de ba? Where can I play this? You can play this on your computer. Yeah. So now, parang yun to. You're thinking about na for this um, robot lang to. Pero imagine if it were in the real society. You could put it like, ano, a black cop or a white cop. Tapos sabi nila, why did you send a black cop in instead of a white cop or something like that? How to download? So Steam siya, yeah. See George Pasadasan. Uh, look at Steam. Right, it's up for Captain Allen. Um, talk to Captain Allen. All right, sure. So we're trying to save a little girl. Sorry, sorry, Erika. Sorry, sorry. Pero yan. Stream mo ngaki na sa Facebook or here sa YouTube. What? Captain Allen. Captain Allen. My name is Connor. So I'm here. the android sent by Cyberlife. He's the very first of his kind. Si Connor. It's firing at everything that moves. Android. It already shot down. Detective Android. Men. We could easily get it, but they're on the edge of the balcony. If it falls, she falls. Do you know its name? Mm -hmm. I haven't got a clue. Does it so, time to decide. To determine uh, the as a team, let's decide. So, we're playing as Connor. Yep. Do you know if it's been behaving strangely before this? But we're playing three different people at Listen, the same time. So, it'll change. That kid is all that matters. Over and over. So, either you deal with this fucking android now, or I'll take care of it. Probability of success 48%. Right. Save hostage as all costs, understand what happened. Alright. So it's not always gonna be a detective themed one. Um, but I mean, it goes deep into. That gonna uh, jump. Deep oh, into. Ma normal people lang. So we're, we're gonna be trying to look for clues. Come back at. Ano, wild young android. So the point is androids don't have like human characteristics, feelings. But then there's this code in their software na they can turn into deviants. So these people, the mga robots na yun, become human, basically. Na nakakaroon na sila ng empathy, etc., etc. Alright. So wait lang. I have lang akong other clues. Oh, I don't think I need that. Yeah, and ganda na to. It's just like exactly like a movie. Alright, so ito yung dad ata ng girl. Ah. Uh, Upper long hemorrhage. Alright, so binaril shark thrice. Okay. So the cool thing about this is like since Android Shah he could re reconstruct your crime scene just by looking at different groups. So ito, he's reconstructing it now. Father was holding something. He went to search for a new clue. And then he got shot by the android. Like that. Oh wait. Oh look. Father was holding something. Yeah, that is okay. Oh wait, oops. 
Wait lang ha, nalilito ako. <laughs> Where do I go? So, binaril siya. Ayan, there, there, there. Then, I found the tablet. Okay. So, this is, ano, this is what makes the Android a lot better than humans. Kasi, they could get the job done a lot faster than if a human investigated this scenario. Diba? Cyberlife thanks you for your purchase. Alright, so let's look for other Oh shit! Cody got life actor man down. Man down. The EAD officer was the first responder, so we can do it analyze this. Actually, it's good game, na to, honestly. The way that you can do detective things. Okay, so gunshot residue. Alright, so he shot the gun at the robot. So he died from the gunshot. Okay, and then there we go. That's it. Alright, so the panod ng kid yung shooting. As well as the yung gun. So na baral yung robot, basically. I think kaya siya ajano. It's a very old game. It's a very old game. I think he'll be able to Android, he could do uh, fluid analysis by just tasting it. I don't know kung packet nila na isip yun, pero sobrang astig nun. Yung sobrang astig ng uh, sobrang astig ng clue na yun. More androids, less work. Yeah, okay, lang. I think okay, lang. So there. So yan yung suspect, and then there's a the girl. Thanks, O Space, for the 37 pesos donation. <laughs> May don donations pa palan naman to. And daming nagaganap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sobrang daming ang nagaganap. Sorry. Pero uh, let's just finish it. Wait, lang. May, I'm missing a blue. Hey, oh, and there we go. Alright, alright. So, probability of success is a lot better now. Understand what happened. So, we have the gun here. Oh, wait, I don't want to take it. Oh my god, the gun is not. Okay, Alright, so, since we na going to do it, we are then. Let's try talking to the robot. Thanks again, O Space, 75 pesos. So yeah, Stay that's back. what makes this guy a lot more. Come any closer, I'll jump. Because no, androids no, don't feel me. pain. Pero may receptors sila for pain. Yes, like they know when they're in danger or not. So the game is called. Hi, Daniel. No, the game my name is, is called. Connor. Detroit, you know become human. I know a lot of things about you. All right, so yes. I've come to get you out of this. Oh my God! All right. The game defense trust. Let's approach soon. Uh, call. I know you're angry, Daniel, but you need to trust me and let 
me help. I don't want your help. Nobody can help me. All I want is for all this to stop. I just want all this to stop. All right. Are you armed? Uh, let's lie. No. I don't have a gun. You're lying. I know you have a gun. Oh my god. I'm telling you the truth, Daniel. I came here unarmed. Yes, this is you my first time playing this. You, but she's done nothing wrong. She lied to me. I thought she loved me, but I was wrong. See, so it's the problem like all with all the other Android humans. thing is that they, they get feelings along the way. They were going to replace you, and you became upset. That's what happened, right? I thought I was part of the family. I thought I mattered. But I was just their toy. Something to throw away when you're done with. So parang it, this game dabbles on I don't know. This Listen, game dabbles on slavery. I know it's not your fault. Parang siyang black mirror these talaga. These emotions you're feeling are just errors See, in your so software. So these emotions are just no, feeling, you know, errors in your it's software. It's not my fault. I never wanted this. I loved them. You know? They weren't programmed to love. But I was nothing to them. <laughs> Just a slave to be ordered around. Yeah, it's an interactive movie, basically. I can't stand that noise anymore. Tell that helicopter to get out of here. Uh, yes, okay, go away first. I want to save the kid. Trust me, Daniel. Let the hostage go, and I promise you, everything will be fine. All right. So I get this trust. To leave. And I want a car. When I'm outside the city, I'll let her go. Uh, you can't do that. That's out of the question. You're a machine. You have to oh obey. Now put the gun down and let the hostage go. I've spent my life taking orders. Please don't kill the girl. My turn oh my time. god, no! Oh my god! Oh, please, please! Hi! No! So, yeah. So, everything you do affects the entire place. So since robot naman siya, he, he doesn't really care if he dies or if he doesn't die. Just as long as he gets the job done. Wild, no? But I won't, I know, there's an option. There's an option that you get to repeat the game to fix the choices you make. But I want to see how the game goes. I want to see how the game goes. I want to see how the game goes with the choices I make. Or the choices I fail to do. Ah, I get it. Yeah, and so, ito, um, what this graph is basically telling. So there are a lot of choices that you could make. And it's basically just showing that uh, you could see how many, I know, how many branches there are based on the responses you use or based on the clues that you got dun sa, I know, from the initial um, investigation. Marami kang, kanwari, ito, I missed out on two clues. Tapos, it affects the entire, ano na, entire scene. And then dito, if you choose one, you're not gonna be able to see all the other choices anymore. And you'll only be able to see it if you play it through it again. But since I'm gonna do it with you guys once, I'll let you guys explore the other options. Na lang. <laughs> yeah, wala na mong reset sa to to ang buhay. Eh. Pero I wanna get to the other parts of the ano, game where we actually discuss on the realities na nangyayari naman now. Just in the pretense of it being robots. So, Bandersnatch, eh, basically. Pero Bandersnatch na wala masyadong do overs. 
Oh, okay, to tama naman talaga si Jeep eh. Wala naman talaga ng ano eh. Wala namang resets in life. This is the top of the range household assistant. It cooks 10,000 different dishes. Come on, Zoe, let's go. Two hundred languages and dialects, and handles the kids. So there are a lot of different um, ano, there are a lot of different robots for different purposes. Hey, it looks amazing. So there are some household helpers. There are some for industrial the moment, use. We're doing a special promotion on this. Yeah, they also explored sex workers and robots. And it poses a real big morality and it comes issue. With a two -year since they're in the likeness of humans. It really constitutes prostitution. But it we'll take it. goes <laughs> against, <laughs> know, it goes legal for <laughs> them. Just follow, they're just robots. The so they also discuss <laughs> this later on. <laughs> na parang, is it okay to have robots as sex workers? Mga ganun. Yeah, I don't like this guy. So if you see, nandun ulit yung other guy. Na, it is. Sa dulo, it's it's rin robot, difficult getting so it back in working order. Okay. It was if you, really messed ano, up. What'd you say? Uh, uh, Maraming different Androids na magkakabuka uh, talaga. See, and it based on how you look, anyway, yun yung ginagawa mo talaga. So now, if you're a household helper, you'll only have a few range of memory. models. So you'd expect you each household be fine. na magkakaroon okay. ng Android. Ganun. Did you give it a name? My daughter did. AX400, register your name. Kara. My name is Kara. So this is another character that we're gonna be following. Her name's Kara. So it's just basically really like a movie. Natatanorin lang natin. What happens? I like it. I like it. Can you imagine a few years into the future? Ganito na yung lifestyle natin na puro electronics. Yeah. Uh, no, they're, this is a different character. But they're all in the same timeline. So, magkakita kita sila in the future. Karamiya. Oh. <laughs> So maganda to kasi ano, you really see the different perspectives of ano, society na. Uh, and it makes you wonder if we actually do really need robots in the likeness of humans in the future. Or if robots na are look like, who look like humans. You know, so nakikita nyo heavily discriminated talaga yung mga robots. Ito, ito yung one of the issues that I was talking about. A lot of humans in this time lost their jobs because of the androids. So a lot of them are actually protesting their existence. Na, let's just eradicate the android. I don't know if it's right to call them a uh, species. Pero yeah. Pero the, you could see na kunwari ito, uh, in Kara's point of view. Or at least dun sa family niya. Ah sige, mamaya ka na lang i-discuss si Kara. This is another character that we're gonna follow. His name is Marcos. But is there a moral defense if they look like humans or not, if their purpose stays the same? Her name is Kara. Oh, the problem is that they made androids perfect. So they don't have any deficiency. So, kaya ano pa papagawa mo sa kanila? Magagawa nila a hundred times better than humans. So let's read the magazine. Okay, so secrets of androids. How cyber life designs its androids to coexist with humans. Uh, yeah, Jason Graff, director of humanization department. They wanted androids to become as human as possible. In yung point ng ano? In yung point ng uh, the company Cyberlife, what they were trying to do with androids. They wanted to create a perfect species. So they were trying to humanize them as much as possible. Para when it comes to the household or wherever, parang it's just the same thing. Climate change. 
Okay, so let's go to the... Uh, let's go to the... So, I need to pick up a painting. But uh, this is a very interesting scene. I'll ask you guys what you think. Pantahin ko lang. Wait lang. Pantahin ko lang. <laughs> Kaya no kalaki ang population dito ng Android. Yung Androids, they're only, they only exist sa United States. Hey, water. So, ito. You're in 12 miles. You know, 5 miles away from your goal. So you can see how they're heavily you know, discriminated. There we go. So let's wait for the green light. Marami na sila actually. They they compromise a whole population. So yung mga androids they also need blood. May organ sila. They're pretty much human. At the end of the day. Oh, I see it now. Let's cross. So imagine how high tech the future could be. Pero nagliliter parin yung mga tao at this time of ano, time of the year. Grab it talaga. Pick your own trash, lady. Grabe, and lang yung pasurahan. Hindi man lang niya matapan. See, even in advanced roots in society, humans will probably be, be the same way they will be. Diba? Okay. Parang at the end of the day. So, we are playing God by creating machines, so, ito, but we may are not dust. At that time. We are nothing but dust. Why do you look at me so, demon? I know who you are. I can see through you. You are the one by whom the evil will come. You are the one who will destroy Detroit. Imagine. Marami mga ganitong radical ngayon. We make these androids in Imagine our own image. Pilipinas to. But they only reflect Tapos, the darkness just change the words a little bit. Tapos makikita mo what kind of people would I know. Like, Wala namang ginagawang crimes yung androids kadalasan until they become deviants, eh. Diba? Imagine. Imagine that. Imagine how close it is to society. And they're not talking about robots now. They're talking about actual races. Parang, what the f- what the f- As in, isip mo ang ina talaga ng mga tao. Na kaya nilang gawin yun sa mga ibang tao na we're just the same people. Crazy. Crazy. Identification. Very so Marcus is not a detective. He's just a normal robot. So kasambay siya or like a. Uh, uh, Here is your order uh, number eight four seven. Uh, made or something. That will be sixty three ninety nine. Please confirm payment. Sabagay. Payment confirmed. Transaction complete. Well, tingin ko, baka makakalimutan din kasi ng mga tao maging humane, pakikiramdam sa lahat ng bagay. Yeah, kasi they're only dealing with robots, diba? But these robots look like humans kasi. Uh, robots become deviants. Hindi ko rin alam eh. Maybe there's a programming or something. Basta nagkakaroon sila ng feelings. We never know. So this scene just basically shows you how discriminated androids are. So yeah, that. look at that. So may temporary parking yung mga androids. Diba? Look, look, look at this. May temporary parking sila. Imagine kung ginagawa yun sa actual dao. So ito, marami na naman protesters. Where the fuck you going, Tin Can? Hmm? What are you doing? Check it out. Hey guys, check it out. We got one of those tin cans here. So ito. Ah. Ang kita mo galo ka assholes talaga mo. This little motherfucker. You steal our jobs, but you can't even stand up. 
So ito yung mga ano, nawalan ng jobs. So maintindihan mo bakit sila ganyan. But I imagine this probably happens in the We're gonna fuck your bitch ass up. Yeah. Waste it. Do it! Alright. It's enough. Leave it alone. Let us teach this bastard a lesson. Yeah, imagine this happens with immigrants to, to different countries. And imagine the protests that are going on. Yeah, it actually happens right now. Let's go. One more. Good cop. I honestly think deviant nga sila because na di discriminate sila. And check this discrimination out. So mero Android compartment in buses. But for you guys, do you think? Android should be treated any differently than humans. Kevin Paul Faustino, this is Detroit Become Human. So the premise of the game is my human robots, basically. Diba? Ang <laughs> I don't know if it's right to say racist, but it is racist. It's, it's, it's evil. It's discriminatory. Wait that. See you later, guys. Alright, hi, okay, hi, I am back. Okay, so, ayan, uh, let's continue. Robotist. <laughs> ang robotist naman. Teka, ang baho paking ganun. So, the game starts off a little bit slow, but it picks up the pace once naging... Sige, sige, sige. Panorin nyo lang. Siguro pwede yung sinabi mo na same ng pagtrato, if totally kagaya ng ganyan sa game. Eh, perfect na ang AM ang magagawa natin. I mean, if at the very least you can't respect anything that resembles life, how can we trust humans to respect another human? Well, that's true. I think the problem with this game is that they made androids to look like humans. And parang the fact that you could cheat something that resembles humans in a very discriminatory way. Siguro naman you probably do it to other human beings as well, diba? Pero yeah, since perfect ngay Android, si mga marginal guys, so it is. You do the housework, the washing, you cook the meals, you take care of. In this family, very poor sila. They're in a poor suburb. So you see na even if mahirap ka, nakikita nila yung importance of having your own Android. Homework, bath, all that crap. Got it? Yes, Todd. Get started down here, then you do upstairs. Go, Tony. Ah, uh, ano? Hi, Tony. Good evening. Welcome back. Ngayon ka lang ata nag-message. Hold right click to stand your environment. Okay, see you. Alright, collect dishes, activate to check the bathroom. Okay, see you. Let's take the dishes. So this is just a, no, a taste of no, a taste of free life for them. A broken family though. If you cannot, yeah. you know, if you don't see it now, this is a very broken family. Maybe depends on what you need. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I can get that. 
day out. I'll bring it tomorrow. Yeah, oh wait, sorry. Yeah. Maguhugas pa pala ng pinggan dito. True to life. Oh my gosh. Sige. Akala ko manonood lang tayo. Pero sige. Maguhugas mo na ako pinggan guys. Wait lang. TV Imagine... <laughs> imagine gano kadali mag Lazada in the future. Oh my god. Siguro... Siguro wala na. Wala na akong... the evil in the future. <laughs> Oi, wag naman kayo magalit sa robot. Yes, Bring me a cold beer. Right away. Hindi naman talaga ito marunong kasi dishwasher lang yung alam niya. So, ayan mo na. Guys. Grabe, lahat ba ng action kailangan kong gawin? Ha? Huh? Sungit mo sa akin? Ha? Huh? Arangan ko kaya yung TV mo, ha? Huh? Yabang mo eh. Out of the way for fuck's oh. sake! Oh, oh, I'm sorry, sorry, Dad. It won't happen again. Oh, my God. Okay, sige. Sorry, sorry. Sorry, sorry. My bad, my bad. Okay, oh, yan yeah, o. No. Beer mo. Sungit. Ano mo yung pinaka... Ayaw ko. Mga masusungit na amo. Grabe talaga. Wild. Yung pinaka ayaw ko. Wait, so activate the vacuum cleaner in the Press the is it? Huh? Igo goes mo na comments from here lang. Yeah, no, you can just listen in. We'll be talking the entire time. Alice! Yes, what? You better stop that right now! So, sama mo naman sa anak mo. Alright, check the backyard. Why is she always pushing me? Always pushing. <clears throat> so if you don't understand, Metro abusive your father. Hmm. So kunin na natin yung mga sinampay natin. Alright, let's grab the clothes. Pero ang hirap talaga. I can't imagine. making robots na perfectly human. Grabe. Doon pa lang mali na eh. Kasi, do we have a right to create humans na perfect? Like, hindi nga siya born naturally. Do we have the right to play God? No? Oh, just to use them. Parang, do we have a right Would you like to play a game? For that. School. Aren't you going to school today? Kawawa naman yung batang to. Wait, no, don't go. I was just warming up to you. Kawawa. Alright, sige. Uh, let's wash the laundry na. <coughs> diba kawawa yung bata? Halatang ano, halatang ina-abuse ng tatay, tahimik, tapos medyo antisocial. That's wrong. So guys, kung magkaanak kayo, uh, don't abuse your children, please. Don't. Kasi, kawawa talaga sila. And in the future, you might be producing the same kind of behavior from them. So kawawa rin yung mga anak nila. What's that? Red ice, hydrochloric ice, lithium, tritium, toluene, drugs. Oh my god. You shouldn't mess around with my stuff. It makes me nervous. I'm sorry, Dad. You just stay the fuck out of my business. Unless you want to piss me off. You want to piss me off? Okay. No, can I, can I just say? <laughs> si Todd na sa radar ko na. Sobrang ayaw ko na sa kanya. <laughs> Douchebag, what the heck? Oh my god. So, yung, ano, yung, what I was saying earlier. So, they might not feel pain. Pero, they are aware of what could hurt them. So, kapag nagbi-blink red yung, yung sensor nila, it just means that they are in trouble of being destroyed. 
Yeah. So, ano na kailangan natin gawin? So, collect trash. Okay, where's the trash guy? Okay, okay. See ya. Grabe naman. Would it hurt to throw your trash? Sa totoo lang. Ang intense masyado na itong part na ito compared sa detective. Ah, uh, just wait. <laughs> pero sobrang ano nito, dystopian vibes. I don't know if you guys are feeling it. Pero sobrang, sobrang ano nyo, um, Black Mirror. Napanood, napanood nyo na ba yung Black Mirror? It, it really gets you thinking. Eh. Like, we're, ano, we're coming to the time na it's possible to happen. But we're not really looking out for the signs that we should, you know, uh, we should be wary of the you know, consequences of our actions as a human race. <laughs> Joshua Avellino with the real talk. It will be hard to take out the trash compared si tra si to Todd trash. <laughs> <laughs> ang daming trash, ang daming trash lalo na sa Pilipinas, man. Grabe. Hindi na ako nakaka, hindi na nakakagulat. Sobrang daming trash sa Pinas. Hindi mo maayos ang gobyerno kung marami ring trash doon, di ba? Hindi mo maayos yung kalat ng gobyerno kung marami trash yung namumuno. Whoops! I said it. Application rejected, credit card, invoice. Okay, so obviously bankrupt na sila. Where do I go? Alright, so let's talk to Todd. Okay, so okay. Oh my god, let's talk to Todd. Oh yeah, guys, you can register to vote. Uh, please. Oh my god, he's doing drugs! He's doing drugs, siya, literal, ngayon. What the fuck? Wait. Oh my god. Todd, please, don't go to drugs. Wait, we're going to finish first floor. Okay, wait. I mean, we're not going to do it. Report to Todd. Hmm. Ayan. Bobo, pipindutin ko pala. <laughs> Tanga. <laughs> pipindutin ko pala. <laughs> Sorry. My bad. Sobrang trash though. Look. Nagme-meth siya. Sa household. The fuck? See. Yan. Yan. Yeah guys. Huwag kayo humit-hit. Huwag kayo humit-hit sa ano. Sa living room. Okay, it's a private joke. Okay, I'm a drug space. No, it's a drug space. Okay, so let's clean this room. Ah, ito, this is interesting. Android quarterback. So, Android. <clears throat> so, ito, ito yung another big issue sa game. Na parang, is it right to have Androids play sa sports? That was nakaran ng rule saying that you could actually have one Android to play. Pero parang inisip mo, how is that fair na? Because that's para sa atin may import tayo, may import tayo sa PBA or whatever sport yun. Antidepressants contains tyanepin. Oh my God, may parel si Todd. Oh, I see. All right, my barrel shot. Got it. Guys, ganito lang naman din yung buhay natin ngayon. Nakaupo lang tayo in front of a computers or TVs niya eh. kasi work ano eh, quarantine eh. This is just quarantine 101. Wag wag niyo i-deny nagka-time na na ganito kakalat yung bahay niyo. Dahil sa quarantine. Hindi <laughs> ako magugulat. 
Alright, let's see. I think we're done here. Uh, that was a bad idea. No, not yet. Alright. Steady room. I mean, it's sure that it's on paid bills. Huh? Alright, so... Ano ito? Ano nakita mo, girl? Oh, what did you see? Okay. Ventilate the room. Ang hirap naman ng controls. Oh, I will box stuff up later for sure. Paano kaya nagkakapera mga tao ngayon? Actually, no nga no. It makes me wonder. Paano nga nagkakapera yung tao in this time? If it's not programming androids. Ano pa ba yung mga ano? What are decisions androids can't make? If you think about it, what are the stuff robots can't make decisions for na kaya gawin ng tao? Kasi if androids can do everything perfectly, so yung mga trabaho na lang, ano, parang yung mga trabaho na lang na pwedeng gawin ng mga tao is taga utos or manager pero kung wala kang 4 years experience of being ano a supervisor paano ka magma-manager oh my god isa pa yan isa pa yan yung ano working experience oh my god we are currently looking for 1 to 4 years experience in uh, excel and and ano ba yung mga finance software <laughs> oh my god the trauma ay nako entertainment industry siguro eh, pero pwede naman sila gumana gum ng mga android na magaling mo umarte i only need two minutes is that okay alice what can we do here alice in wonderland Aww. alice in wonderland of course Cute. Siguro naman. I think everything is cheap now. Kasi if you think about it, tawag dito, if you think about it, oh. Kung nagagawa everything perfectly, the commodities would probably be always in stock. Kaya, kaya mag-afford ng kahit ito suburban family ng Android. Kasi siguro mura na talaga lahat. Nag-apply ka for experience pero hindi Seems ka makapasok kasi wala ka experience. Totoo yan, men. Sobrang struggle yan. Especially nung first time ko maghanap ng trabaho. Sasabihin nila open to fresh graduates. Pero kailangan ng experience ng one year. Ano yun? Paano naman yun? Kakalabas lang ng software. Naghanap ng 10 years experience. Diba? Nakakainis. Cute. What's happening at that shop? I think we should come inside. Why is it not open? All right, so let's just open the door. Oh, you know, kait pero sa PhilHealth na apoy na kait na dalang alam. Bakit kasi walang job description yung PhilHealth na yun? Kaya namin naman. Sa atin, I'm sure we used to be friends before we to sa mga karaniwang mamamayan, pero sa mga politician, kailangan lang kaibigan. Ano ba yan? The nepotism. Your father said you chose my name. Kara, it's nice. How did you choose it? Interesting. You should tell me about yourself. What you like to do, where you like to go, your favorite foods. That would really help me. Nakakaawa naman tong batang to. What about your mother? Will she be home soon? Oh fuck! Oh my god. <coughs> I 
sorry, I shouldn't have asked about your mom. <laughs> Touchy topic na pala. Okay. Uh, remind me, wag masyadong mag-pry into touchy topics. Pero ganun akong, ganun akong tao eh. Ako usually, wala akong boundaries when I ask. Kaya, ayun, hindi ko pala namalayan na insulto ko na pala yung kausap ko. Oh man. We shall see ano meron. So my 4D Flover. O nga no, hindi ako nagpaalam. Pero siguro naman, she gave me permission. Oh. So my mom nga siya. Pero siguro namatay na. I feel. I feel namatay na yung mom niya. Oh my god. So abused child nga siya. Abusive father. Okay, so nasira ako before, basically. You know, there's something about drawing salaga of children that are very telling of their experiences. Kawawa, honestly, sobrang kawawa. Alright, we're done here. Yeah, siya yun, siya yun. Um, you could easily replace your Android kasi in this scenario. Yeah. So if you're broken, you could order for a new one. Na para may warranty. May warranty period siya. What are you doing? Uh, I'm playing. You're playing. I know what you're thinking. You think your dad's a low life? Huh? Fucking loser? Can't get a job? Take care of his family? Don't you think I tried to make things work? But whatever I do, when someone comes along, they just fuck it all up! Fuck. I know what you think of me. You hate me. You hate me, don't you? Shit. Say it! Fuck, so you hate away. me! God. What am I doing? I'm sorry, honey. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You know I love you, don't you? You know I love you. Fuck. Medyo naiiyak ako whenever I see that. Sobrang... Oh my god. Imagine... Imagine ito game lang to, pero it actually happens in real life. What the fuck? Oh, may hindi ako nagawa ng dalawa. Pero sige lang. Pero imagine, parang imagine na nangyari talaga 'yon. Holy shit. Pero hindi mo alam eh. You can't stop it because it happens in the household. Tapos paminsan nalalaman mo na lang kasi nababalitaan mo na namatay na 'yung na naging homicidal na 'yung father. It's hard to prevent domestic abuse, lalo na if hindi na report ng maayos so oh, I don't know I don't know how you prevent it as neighbors ba should be is it right to pray on your other neighbors na i-report mo sila even if you're not entirely sure anyway so we're back to Marcos maganda rin yung story nito uh, for me ah sige hindi ko na lang ano, take care of her Ito, ito, funny, funny ito. Kasi, <laughs> pati, pati ibon na wala ng, ng purpose. So, pati mga animal, ginawa na ring robot. <laughs> Grabe naman. Eh, yung hindi ko maintindihan, kung lahat naman pala pwedeng gawin robot, is there even a point for human, ano, for life to exist? If everything can actually be perfect and utop utopian with the inventions people make, no?
Ano pa ano pa nagagawa ng tao? Na kung ganito lahat ng bagay. Ang weird. Wow, that's a shelly naman ito. Okay, sige. Uh... Sige na. Tinatawad na ako. Uh... Sige, gisingin na natin si Carl. Uh, the game is uh, Detroit Become Human. Yung title ng game. So basically, nasabi ko na ilang beses ko. Uh, it's the time when there are human robots. Baka na-extinct na yung mga ibon. Baka nga, baka nga. Saan ba yung kwarto niya? Grabe naman yung bahay na to. Napakalaki naman masyado. Imagine if you were a person living alone in such a big house. Parang ayaw ko rin. Parang ayaw ko. I wouldn't want to live in a huge house. Na ako lang mag-isa. Good morning, Carl. Good morning. It's 10 a.m. The weather is partly cloudy, 54 degrees. Tell you guys, would you with a strong possibility of afternoon Android? showers? It sounds like a good day to spend in bed. Sabagay, if there I did are advancements in everything, the paint that you ordered. Oh, siguro yes, naman 20, 2100 that something to. Tapos nag global warming na. Markers. So namatay na karamihan ng you ano, never forget life uh, animals. Siyempre, greedy tayong mga humans. Eh. Show me your arm, please, Carl. No. Carl. Thank you. Hmm. I just opened my eyes and I'm already gritting my teeth. Humans are such a fragile machine. Pag super they down so quickly. Hmm? All this effort lonely na lonely ka, no? to keep them going. Hey. What happened to your clothes? Oh, it's nothing. Just some demonstrators in the street, Carl. What a bunch of idiots. They think they can stop progress by roughing up a few androids? I hope they didn't harm you. Oh, no, no. They just pushed me around, Carl. I'm fine. Okay. You know, if my okay, organs are not humans, I'm going to uh, they were created by the company then. So they're robotic parts. Pero they made it exactly like humans. So may kidneys rin sila, pero robotic. May hearts din sila, pero robotic. So they really made it like... Like, ano? They're really like humans. <laughs> so ito, inisip ko. If you were a dependent old person, I see the appeal of having your own android. When you're old and like this, you probably get one talaga. Alright, okay, so ito si Carl. So backstory lang. Si Carl ay isang ano, uh, famous artist. Uh, isa siyang famous artist, kaya siya yumaman. Anything special on the and agenda I think, today? Yes, there's siya. the opening of your retrospective at the Museum of Modern Art. Mm. Ano, the gallery director left four messages don't see asking robots to confirm your attendance. Are hmm. able to create something original. I haven't decided yet. We'll Kasi, see about that later. How do you program what creativity, else? diba? Just your usual fan mail. I've already answered. Hmm. Diba? Parang how do you program creativity? Kaya siguro you know? sobrang yaman ng mga artists and painters no, ng mga songwriters. I can call them if you like. No. Kasi creativity no, is something very human for me. Can you recreate creativity ba? Yung originality in a sense. Okay. I'm starving. Wait, na excited na ako. We're getting to the good ready. parts. We're Bacon getting to the good parts. Just the way you like them. Thank you, Marcus. You're welcome. Parang kapag nag-program ka kasi ng kaya hindi, hindi na siya original. Mm. 
may pinanggalingan na. So parang they can't create something original, diba? They will always have to some ano, base something. They will always have to base it on something na nakita na nila or something part of their programming. Why don't you find something to do while I finish my breakfast? Sure. Totoo naman. Hmm? Okay, Carl. Sa Pilipinas kasi ano, hindi naman uso yung ano eh, yung home for the aged. Very strong yung ano, yung roots of Filipinos to, ano, to take care of the elderly. Tingnan mo ito. Maglalaban ang isang mm. human versus an android. Fancy game of chess. Sure, yeah. Speed chess. Speed chess it is. How do you expect to win against the robot? Sige, let's intentionally lose. <laughs> oh. That was just a little bit too easy. Are your circuits rusty? Or you're just taking pity on an old man. See, exactly. Well, I thought you'd enjoy winning. Never throw a match, Marcus. If you can win, win. That's diba? what got humanity where it is today. Imagine kung di competed. Tapos kalaban mo ang isang human. They have the choice of letting you win or letting you lose. You'll have to protect yourself. So talagang make your choices. Eh. Decide who you are and want to become. This world doesn't like those who are different, Marcus. Don't let anyone tell you who you should be. Let's go to the studio. Ito, so dito, makikita niyo na, no? there is something about sa programming ng robots which allows them to become human. So they, not only are they thinking, but they are also feeling that. So, maya maya makikita niyo what I'm trying to say. <laughs> Sobrang astig ng room nito, honestly. Imagine in the future, ganito na yung mga painter. <laughs> Ed, uh, may feel, yeah, later later, makikita mo. Tingnan mo, ang ganda. Let's see where we left heck? off. Imagine mo, ganyan Remove in the future. The sheet. Siguro sobrang... Sobrang sayan na. So natapos man na siya, aka game. No, I haven't finished it. I only know the gists of a lot of things. Pero what would happen based on the choices na hindi, hindi rin. So medyo original place through naman ka. Whole podcast, pretty much. I want you guys to, you know, uh, see yung mga good parts. Mahaba ba? It's around 10 hours long, siguro. 9 hours long. Kaya inisip ko kasi if I should just break this down into parts. Pero, inisip ko rin, parang, I want you guys to see the entire movie. Maganda kasi siya. Maganda talaga siya. Maganda, no? How, yung ano mo? Is it all worth it, though? Yung quality of life mo ganito. And the future. Parang with all the advancements, so, inisa ko, ano nga pa pwede maging trabaho mo in the future? Kung lahat na automated, ano pa ba yung point natin? Yes, there is something about it. Hmm. Diba? Something I can't ano pa kaya yung point natin quite in the define. I think once we hit that technological advancement like point, parang the truth is I have nothing humans will probably anymore. lose its purpose. Each day that goes Kasi by brings me closer it, to the end. Very just an old man who cleaned his brushes. My point on each animal. Pero kapag but enough about mo lahat me, ng aspects mo, let's see if you have ano any talent. Give it a try. Cool I'm painting cool something. Paint? But would I? Painting what? Anything you want. Give it a try. 
So, makakapag-paint ba ako something original? We shall see. So, are robots capable of painting something? Hmm. <laughs> Imagine nyo, pinaint ko yung painting ni Carl. Tapos mas maganda yung kinalabasan ng akin. Hmm. Parang ayaw ko i-hurt feelings niya. Sige, wag na lang. <laughs> Pawawa naman siya. Tanda na nga eh. Doon tayo sa hindi siya ma-hurt. That is a perfect copy of reality. The painting is not about replicating the world it's about interpreting improving on it showing something you see carl i don't think i can do that it's not in my program I... go on go try it grab that canvas Shepre, mabilis magpaint kasi robot Pero ito, this is something that you know might change your opinion on how you should look at the androids and this in do this something for game me. close your eyes it might change your perspective Trust a little me. bit. And dito yung the point that I was trying to get into. Try to imagine something that doesn't exist, something you've never seen. Now concentrate on how it makes you feel and let your hand drift across the canvas. So, we were talking about we were talking about robots can create something original, diba? But what if mga robots they become self-aware and in their self-awareness they begin to have feelings that they can actually decide on their own that they have rational thoughts. And they have originality. Oh my god. Are they human na? Hey dad. Would you consider them as human? Leo. I didn't hear you come in. Oh, I was in the neighborhood. I thought I'd stop by. It's been a while, right? You alright? You don't look so good. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> hey, listen, uh, I need some cash, Dad. Again? What happened to the money I just gave you? Uh, well, it's, it just goes, you know? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you're on it again, aren't you? No. No, no, I swear, it's not that. No, uh, don't lie to me, Leo. What difference does it make? I just need some cash, that's all. Sobrang high niya, no? Sorry. Halatang halata. The answer's no. What? Ano yung mas what? ayaw ko sa... You know ano? why. Ano mo yung mas ayaw yeah. ko sa... Yeah, I think I do know why. Ano? <laughs> Bad parents. You'd rather, you rather take care of your uh, plastic toy Mga epal na son. anak. Oh right? my god. Dun, I mean, dun umiinit ulo ko. Smarter? More Mga tulad obedient? Na, parang ano? Not like me, parang, right? What the fuck? But you know what? This thing is not your son. It's a fucking machine! Leo, that's enough. <laughs> enough. You don't care about anything except yourself and your goddamn paintings. You've never loved anyone. You never loved me, Dad. I hate son. You know, never I loved hate. Me. I hate children again. Ito sobrang asan yung tinapon yung buhay. Tapos it, you're gonna treat your parents wrong. What the fuck? Sobrang the fuck. De ba George pasad? That's the fuck. Oh my god. Fuck those people. Sa totoo lang. Ena. Slim, slim na ka. Ah. Paano if Apple anak may in the future? Oh my god. Hindi na lang ako magkaka anak. <laughs> ah, yoko, please sana hindi. 
Okay, ito na. We're getting to the good part. So I'll be playing this for another hour. Uh, in the next or exciting na siya. Pero before that, si CR lang ako. <laughs> Pag di na binagyan ng pera, hindi na mahal. Maraming ganong anak do. Parang they treat their parents as bank, money banks. Tapos they forget na they're actually their parents. So nawawala yung respeto. Ah, uh, this is something interesting. Sa ano. Imagine being in the future na na facial recognition ga. Tapos nakikita yung ano mo, personal details, siya yung mga criminal records mo if you had. Would you feel safe ever going out? Would you feel na na-discriminate ka every day? Mga ah, ganun. Wanna buy me a drink? Domestic abuse, see? Parang mga ganito. How would you feel na uh, nagiging ganito yung future mo? Nineteen eighty-five. Medyo ka-age lang natin to. <laughs> Tapos ang tandaan niya dito. So kung mangyari man to in the future, ganito na tayo katanda guys. Literal lolo na. <laughs> I looked for you at the station, but oh nobody knew God. where you were. They said you were probably pala tayo sa ganitong reality. I was lucky to find you at the fifth bar. What do you want? You were assigned a case early this evening. A homicide involving a cyberlife android. In accordance with procedure, the company has allocated a specialized model to assist investigators. Well, I don't need any assistance. Especially not from a plastic ass. Oh, fun fact. Kung kilala niyo si Mr. Krabs ng SpongeBob, ito yung voice actor niya. Yung matanda. Listen, I think you should stop drinking and come with me. Lahat ng characters in this game, kung sino yung voice actor nila, kahawag nila yung person sa game. So, ito talaga yung ano, it's very in the likeliness of Mr. Krabs. I am perfectly comfortable. Back off before I crush you like an empty beer can. You know what? I'll buy you one for the room. What do you say? Bartender? The same again, please. Good enough. See that gym wonders of technology. Make it a double. I wonder if kung gagawa rin sila ng robot na pwede mong kainuman. <laughs> Sayo siguro nun. Did you say homicide? Oh my god, sobrang excited na ako. Oh, super excited ako for you guys. Sobrang excited ako. My instructions are to accompany you to the crime scene, Lieutenant. Listen, I don't give a fuck about your instructions. I told you to wait here, so you shut the fuck up. Oh, and my, I, I, I wasn't able to explain something. Uh, your choices that you make, may nakikita yung arrow na up and arrow na down. So it just explains your relationship more with the people around you, and sometimes there are choices that you don't want to make. 
dahil I'm your relationship with the person is bad or your relationship with the person is too good. So, paminsan hindi mo na nagagawa yung ibang bagay. Which is pretty, you know. Androids are not permitted beyond this point. <laughs> it's with me! What part of staying in the car didn't you understand? <laughs> you don't talk, you don't touch anything, and you stay out of my way. Got it? Got it. Evening, Hank. We were starting to think you weren't gonna show. Yeah, that was the plan till this asshole found me. So, you got yourself an android, huh? Oh, very funny. Just tell me what happened. We had a call around eight from the lab. Oh, it's okay. So I'll just re breeze through this. So we thought he'd drop by. So what's going on? Wait, maglakad ka naman maayos, bro. Hello? Ah, okay, sige. Alright. Jesus, that smell! It was even worse before we opened the windows. The victim's okay. name's Carlos Ortiz. The victim's name's Carlos Ortiz. He has a record for theft and aggravated assault. According to the neighbors, he was kind of a lone owner. Stayed inside most of the time, they hardly ever saw him. Wow, well, stayed he's in. What worth No fingerprints, Android involvement. Calling everybody out in the middle of the night. Could have waited till morning. Dried blood, okay. So I'd say he's been there for a good three time. weeks. We'll know more when the coroner gets here. There's a kitchen. Knife over here, probably the murder weapon. Any sign of a break in? Nope. The landlord said the front door was locked from the inside. All the windows Did were boarded up. Did you just taste it? Yeah. The killer must have got so, out the back. So, ganon yung ginagawa ng mga no, androids in this game. Not much. The way they the investigate. Ah, ito yung cool thing about it. Because I, walang ano, walang fingerprints ang mga robot. They could tamper with the evidence without compromising the without compromising the crime scene. Kasi hindi mo naman malalagay yung fingerprints mo anywhere. So it, parang if you think about it, they make the perfect ano, detectives. Ito, ito yung sinasabi ko. Android sex officially better. Sorry, leaders, but plastic can't be beat. Uh, they made androids a sex workers na. So sorry, they there were free reasons given for the preference, but you know the real reason. Blah 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 blah. blah. So parang in, if you think about it, is it okay to do that? Parang is it okay to create sex? Things for sexual exploitation in the resemblance of humans. Yun yung one of the moralities sa game nata na parang ano very questionable. Na should should humans actually should we as a society even try to explore that? Parang parang may malik. It's like playing God again. Need a badge more. Let's reconstruct. The event of the knife. Okay. Ah, uh, parang wala na. Let's keep moving. Sa bagay, wala kang STD mo. <laughs> Totoo naman. Emotional talk. stuff do we need to look at ba? for work well if you think about it there are sex toys ngayon na human like to an extent what but this but it's still not so human eh I don't know kayo ba what do you think Mga, yeah, 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 diba? Parang, what do you guys think? Eh, kasi at least yun, alam mong hindi buhay. Ito, buhay. Buhay, buhay sila, technically. They're living beings na walang heart. Really? 
religious offering, right? Alright, so how many stuff do we need to see, man? How did I know? Oh, it's everywhere! Grabe naman kayo! It's everywhere! Chris, is this written in the victim's blood? Grabe naman! Huwag niyo naman ako yung judge! I would say so. Alam niyo naman din yun eh! Seems our friend Carlos liked to party. I am alive. Would a would a robot say that? Hi, so Carlos Ortiz. Twenty-eight knife woods, frustrated murder. Frustrated. I don't know if that's the right term, pero grabe na yun 28, sobra na yun. Fingerprints. Oh, so this guy was high also. Oh my, among us. Pinag-usapan niya namin yun kanina eh, parang... Ah... I want to play it again though with you guys. Stabbed. Asal kasi yun sa ano eh. If you're playing with random people. Seems like the killer really had it in for. So it's murder, murder na exaggerated. Wow. Okay. Chris, I want full analysis on the narcotics. I think I figured out what happened. Oh yeah? Shoot, I'm all ears. It all started... In the kitchen. In the kitchen. There are obvious signs of a struggle. The question is, what exactly happened here? Mm, yeah. I think the victim attacked the android... With a bat. With the bat. Lines up with the evidence. Uh -huh. Go on. The, the android stabbed, stabbed the victim. victim. Sorry, nagbabasao guys. The android was trying to defend itself. Ayoko magkamali. Ayoko nang may mamatay ulit. Aka me. The victim fled to. The living room. The living room. Ouch. Ouch. And he tried to get away from the android. Ouch. Alright, that makes sense. The android murdered the victim. With a knife. With the knife. 28 times. Okay. Your theory's not totally ridiculous. Oh my god, it doesn't tell us where the android went. It was damaged by the bat and lost some therium. Lost some what? Therium. Therium. You call it blue blood. So blue blood. It's the fluid that powers androids' bio components. No, this isn't the abusive father. It evaporates this is after different a few hours and this becomes is invisible person. to the naked eye. Oh. But I bet you can still see it, can't you? Correct. So yeah, my blood then um, androids. So it's called Ethereum Blue Blood. And pag nawawalan sila, namamatay sila. Ganda na music. Ang intense. I'm 
imagine mo kung nandun siya ano? something to climb. What about that? Awesome! Let's tamper with the evidence. Hey, 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 what are you doing with that chair? I'm going to check something. Bulaga! <laughs> Search the attic. Hmm. Ang tense, no? Ang intense! I love it, I love it. <laughs> I know where you are. Nah, ini nama horror nama tu. Ano lang nama sya? Suspense, thriller, thriller, kumbaga. Putang ina ka. Alam ko nang nandun siya. Nagulat pa rin ako. <laughs> I was just defending myself. <laughs> He's gonna kill me. I'm begging you. Don't tell him. Do I tell them? What the fuck is going on up there? Fuck. Fuck. It's here, Lieutenant. Wow. Oh shit. Chris, Ben, get your asses in here now! My God, see it, mood. Come on! Si Connor yung ayaw mo maging best friend, kasi lagi kang itatatal tayo siguro niyon. Ay, eto na. I'm eto eto. I'm excited for this one. Okay, so guys, manood kayo, manood kayo. Manood kayo, manood kayo. Manood kayo. This is the best. Hindi ako magsasalita masyado. Pero manood kayo. Todd. <gasps> so we are back to Kara and Alice and Todd. So ito na. Uh, makikita niyo yung doings na... Dinner is ready. I know. Jollibee spaghetti. Tagal ko nang hindi nag ano. Tagal ko nang hindi nag Jollibee spaghetti. Parang sarap tingnan do. So mag Jollibee spaghetti. Turn on the light. No nga naman, but nga naka-off yung ilaw niya. Turn on the light. Sorry. I can't see shit. Oh my god, san pa kasi? Ayun. Sigawan pa tuloy ako. Ayan, hinahanap na nga eh. Siguro kung naging robot ako, lakas ka mag-sorry. <laughs> androids don't need to eat or drink. I lost my job because of androids. They want to need somebody to take care of this Nagayan goddamn house. What do I do? I go out and hire Fucking android. What a joke. Uh, of course, androids are so fucking wonderful. They 
never fail. They never tired. They never sad. They're so fucking perfect. They ruined my fucking life. Dami siguro ganun yung sentiments. If ever magkatotoo ang mga Android. What are you at? What's your fucking problem? Not the life you dreamed of, eh? Nananahimik na nga, eh. Oh, why are you Maybe you think this is easy. Maybe you think it's my fault we live in this fucking shithole. My fault your fucking mother took off. You should stop taking drugs, Todd. Sometimes you really scare me, Todd. Fucking bitch took off without a word. Fucking whore walked out on me for a fucking accountant. Fucking fuck! So Alice. Get back here. Come back here? Come back here right now! Fuck. Yes! You stay there. Don't you dare fucking move. So this is the exact like moment. Na magiging human si Kyra. So there's something happening in their programming. Na nagiging human na siya. Well, not in nagiging human. Pero nagiging ano na siya? Self-aware. So now she has, she can make choices on her own. Na hindi na niya kailangan makipag-usap with people. Anyway, ah, uh, since ayoko kay Todd, may balak talaga ako doon sa kanya. <laughs> oh my God! Sorry, guys. But it's the thing we have to do this. We need to do this. Sorry, Todd. We gotta do this. We gotta do this. We need to protect ourselves. What the fuck are you doing? Put down the gun and get the fuck out of here. That's an order. No, I want you to leave her alone. You want? What do you mean you want? What are you gonna do? You gonna shoot me? Is that it? You gonna shoot a human? You seem to have a problem. I think we need to fix that. Oh, oh. Watch out, Kara! Oi! Stop that! Don't hurt her! Ai! Fogo! You do as I say. Sorry, wait, I'm here up cuz God, sobrang hassle. Oh my God. Okay, nope. We gotta run, Kara. We gotta run, Alice. Come on, there. Let's let's bounce, Alice. Hon, hello. Hi. 
bounce, bounce, bounce. Why? So this is the start. Kung kailan na every part of the way exciting na story nila Kara, because they are officially on the run. So lahat na ganito on the run na sila forever. And yung goal lang ni Kara is to protect Alice no matter what. I'm excited. Lalo na dun sa next few ano, parts nila. So ito, ito yung ano, one of the scenes that people actually replay a lot. Kasi look how wide the uh, choices are. So yung butterfly effect niya, napaka ano, huge. So there are ano, choices here. I spoil ko na rin na pwedeng mamatay both si Kara and si Alice. So I just made sure na ito, this is a part na I played up to. Para, ano, to make sure na buhay sila pareho. So linaro ko na until here. So the extent of my knowledge is until dito lang. Kasi kapag namatay na sila, hindi na matutuloy yung story nila ever. <laughs> so, ayan. So ito yung mga branches na to. Ito yung, ano, it leads up to here na mamatay silang pareho. No matter what you do. So, yun. And I didn't want them to die. Because I know that their story is a lot better. It gets a lot better after they escape. Yes, magiging wanted sila. So, yung alam ko, mahabulan sila ni Connor, yung detective android. So, they're gonna be on the run. Tapos, mahabulan sila. Nang, ano. So, you have the choice if mahabulan sila by the detective or not. Every time I go to one of these, I ask myself, I like it. what the hell am I doing here? I hate cocktail parties and all the schmoozers that go there. Well, it's a chance for all those people who admire your work to meet you. Yay! Oh man, I know I give a damn about <laughs> Yay! All they care about is how much money they're going to make out of it. Ka- Come on, let's have a Marta drink with the excitement. Um, this whole thing has made me thirsty. Sure. But I feel na si Marcos isa sa mga robots na magkaka-feelings. Scotch, neat as usual? Absolutely. Okay, but you know what your doctor would say. Yeah, feel ko yung tatla na mga susundan mo magkaka-self-awareness. Kasi we're playing th- them eh. So we have the human aspect to it. Did you leave the light on in the studio? No, no, I'm sure I didn't. Call the police. Detroit police, what's your emergency? This is Carl Manfred's android at 8941 Lafayette Avenue. We've just returned home and found the lights on. There may have been a break-in. A patrol car is on the way. Let's go check it out. Alam mo, kung ako yung android, Hindi ko na itadala yung matanda kong amo sa loob ng room na may potential burglar. <laughs> Alam mo, dito ka na lang. Iwan na lang kita dito. Pwede pa kita iwan. Iwan na lang. Hindi pwede. Hmm. Sige, patalikod tayo pumasok guys. In case na nandyan siya sa pintuan. Patalikod tayo. Moonwalk tayo. Para hindi siya yung unang atake yan, di ba? Leo! What are you doing? You refuse to help me, so I'm helping myself. It's crazy what some people pay for this shit. Don't touch them! Look, they're all gonna be mine sooner or later anyway. Just think of it as a down payment on my inheritance. Marcus, get him away from there. Get him out of here! That's reasonable. Be reasonable. This isn't gonna get you anywhere. All you ever do is tell me to go away. What's wrong, Dad? Not good enough for you? Not perfect like this fucking thing? That's enough! Get out! Right now! What makes what? it so special Whoa. anyway, huh? Where's it got that I don't? Leave him alone! Holy shit! Come on! Let's see what you got! Marcus, don't defend yourself, you hear me? Don't do anything. Yeah, no. Go ahead. Hey, what you waiting for? Think you're a man? Act like one! 
Stop it! What's the matter, too much of a pussy? Stop Man. it, Leo! Stop it! Too scared to fight back, you fucking bitch! Uh. Uh. Then, 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 no, no, no. No, no, no. No. Leo, I'm better than you! I am 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 better than you! Nee, nee, nee! Sige na, wag na mahiya! Nee, nee, nee! No, 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 we have... Fine, sige na! Sabi nyo eh! Sige, gawin na lang natin! Sabi nyo, sabi nyo! I will listen to you guys. Ah, sige, sapakan tayo. Huh? Yapa mo, ha? Let's go. Oh, right, that's right. I forgot you're not a real person. You're just a fucking piece of plastic. Oh, man, Leo, tara, Leo. No. I'm gonna destroy you. Then I'll just be me and my dad. I'm gonna tear you apart. And nobody's gonna give a shit. Man, huh? Oh, fuck. Nakitay ko siya. Oh, my God. Oh, fuck! Okay, wait, wait, hindi ko yan ginusto, I just wanted to show him a lesson. Leo. Holy shit, sorry! Oh my god. Sorry! Oh my god, fuck! Leo. Sorry, sorry, wait. Sorry, 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 man. My little boy. Oh my god. Carl, I... Oh my god. Carl, sorry. Oh fuck, sorry. They'll destroy you, Marcus. Oh fuck, sorry. You gotta go. Oh my god. Get out of here. Holy shit. No, 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 no. Uh, uh, uh. Back, back. Carl, no. No, please, I don't want to leave you. Please, I can't. I don't want to leave you. Get out! Now! Go! Fuck. Marcus! Don't fucking move! Mamatay ba ako doon kung hindi ako nag-endure? Oh, dapat pala hindi ako lumaban doon. Oh, shit. Fuck. Dapat ba hindi ako lumaban doon? Guys. <laughs> okay. That's one character gone. Dalawa na lang wala laro natin. What happened before you took that knife? Oh, shit. How long were you in the attic? Oh, shit. Why didn't you even try to run away? Oh, shit. Napatata, hindi ko na lang siya linabanan. Say something, goddammit! Fuck it, I'm out of here. Hindi siya, hindi siya character ko. Nagro role play lang ako, ano man? Hindi ko yun gagawin in real life. We get nothing out of it. Hindi ko yun gagawin in real life. You always try roughing it up a little. After all. Yeah, but no, 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 no. Let's stick with our decision. Androids don't feel pain. You would only damage it. Sa bagay, kung hindi ko rin nabanan, siguro at the end of the day, mamatay ako. I have a feeling, either way, mamatay ako. Okay, smartass. What should we do then? I think kapag naging ano na kasi na, I think if they become deviants, hindi mo pwedeng, ano, hindi mo nang pwede access memory. We have to lose. That's why kailangan mo i-interrogate. Go ahead. Suspect's all yours. Okay, sige. Let's, let's, let's. Mamatay yung tatay! Carjack arrest! Well, mas gusto ko mabuhay yung tatay kaysa sa anak. Okay, sige. Let's interrogate him. Mamatay pala yung tatay kung hindi ko ginawa. Okay, sige. Bahala na. Let's just do it. Let's analyze. Burn 
marks. Repeated marking over 16 months because of cigarettes. Grabe naman. Grabe naman yung owner niya. Imagine, sinasunog mo yung ano mo. Wild. If you can't treat them right, why get one? Reach optimal stress for compensation. Okay. Take it. It's work. <laughs> My name is Connor. What about you? What's your name? an instability in your program. It can trigger an unpleasant feeling, like fear in humans. Let's uh, reassure him. I'm not going to hurt you. I just need to ask you some questions so we can understand what happened. Hey, eh, too low. Threaten. You don't seem to understand the situation. You kill <laughs> a human. No, They'll tear stress. you apart if you don't say something. If you won't talk, I'm going to have to probe your memory. No! No, please don't do that. Stress out siya. Oops, my bad. I'm too sympathetic. Oh, it's okay. What? What are they gonna do to me? They're going to disassemble you to look for problems in your bio components. They have no choice if they want to understand what happened. Why did you tell them you found me? Bad cop, good cop, pa lang ato na. Why couldn't you just have left me there? Because I'm a robot. I was programmed to hunt deviants like you. I just accomplished my mission. I don't want to die. Then talk. See, my concepts are of dying. Imagine. I... I can't. Choose approach. Hmm. Pressure never happened. 28 stab wounds. You didn't want to leave him a chance, huh? Did you feel anger? Hate? He was bleeding, begging you for mercy, but you stabbed him again and again and again. Oh, please. I know you killed him. Why don't you say it? Oh, please. Please stop. All right. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Come on, man. Everything is going to be okay. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, okay. You're a machine you were designed to obey, so obey! Okay, okay. Tell me what happened! I know you're scared. <laughs> Grabe naman yung ano, yung switch niya of good cop, bad what cop. <laughs> Bipolar ka, girl! <laughs> sobra, sobra ano naman ng ano. Sige, terrify natin siya. They'll make you suffer. <laughs> sobra mood swings you naman siya. Diba? Kung tao talaga to, hindi siya sisirin. It doesn't have to be that way. <laughs> Uy. It all depends on you. Uy. Ay, kung hindi ka sumirin, papatayin ka nila. Pero bakit ka ganyan? Pero, you me promise, day. ako aalaga sa'yo. <laughs> I did whatever he told me, but... Weird, weird. That's so weird. There was always something wrong. <laughs> Then one day... He took a bat and started hitting me. For the first time, I felt... Scared. Scared he might destroy me. Scared I might die. Scared? Robots feeling scared? So I... Grabbed a knife and I stabbed him in the stomach. better 
So I stabbed him again and again until he collapsed. Weird thing is, people would actually do that. There was blood everywhere. As in real people, eh? not just robots. Why did you write, I am alive, on the wall? I don't imagine why. He used to tell me I was nothing. That I was just a piece of plastic. Diba maraming ganun cases of murder na nakukulong yung, to write it. yung victim of abuse. To tell him he was wrong. Dahil they murdered them too much. May ganun, diba? The sculpture. So the makukulong pa sila, kahit it, even if it was in a state of self-defense. Based on the circumstances na... Sobre yung stabs na ginawa nila. I don't know. The sculpture was an offering. An offering to Alam ba nila na nagiging self-aware ang mga robot in time? Young humans know that robots can become self-aware. But robots don't know that they can become self-aware. RA-9. It was written on the bathroom wall. What does it mean? The day shall come. When we will no longer be slaves. No more threats. No more humiliation. We will be the masters. RA9. Who is RA9? Parang nakakatakot nga magkaroon ng robotic future. Lalo na kapag nag uprising ang mga robots or yung mga AI away, na gusto na nila i-overthrow yung human beings holy time, shit no sobrang nakakatakot yun I was diba? so parang what do we do once mangyari yun when did you start feeling emotion before he used to beat me and I never said anything. Like what? Di ba meron ng ano? I don't know if you guys heard about it. Pero di ba meron ng mga ano? Yung ginawa ng scientist, dalawang AI, who started talking to each other. Tapos eventually, um, nagkaroon na sila ng self-language. They had their own language that they created by themselves. And then, to the point na hindi na naiintindihan ng mga scientists what they were talking about. So they had to... They had to cancel the entire experiment because they have the fear that baka magkaroon ng ano um, self-destructive tendencies na yung AI. Na baka pinag-uusapan na pala nila to eradicate the human species mga ganun. So parang nakakatakot, no? Yeah, 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 yun, yun. That's the experiment I was talking about. So what if ganun na yung mga AI, no? Na hindi lang ganito eh, kasi they speak English pa. What if they have their own needs of communication? Tapos, yun pala, they're starting an uprising. Tapos, ito overthrow na pala tayo mga humans. Kasi parang wala na rin tayong point pag may AI na eh. Like, what do we do? Wala naman tayong Where's ginawa, like kundi mag-consume eh. Consume ng limited resources. Alright, okay, let's let go. Let me consume alone. anything. Don't touch me. What the fuck are you doing? Move it! Okay. You shouldn't touch it. It'll self-destruct if it feels threatened. Stay out of this, got it? The fucking Andrew's gonna tell me what to do. I don't understand. Dita. If it self-destructs, we won't get anything out of it. I told you to shut your fucking mouth. Chris, you gonna move this asshole or what? I'm trying. I can't let you do that. Leave it alone now. I warned you, motherfucker. That's enough. Mind your own business, Hank. I said that's enough. Woo, Hank! Hank, Mr. Krabs! <laughs> My hero. You're not gonna get away with it this time. Thanks, Mr. Krabs. <laughs> Salamat, Mr. Krabs. Everything is alright. It's over now. I hope nobody's gonna hurt you. I hope maging kampi kasi Mr. Krabs in the Don't touch it. Ano. Let it follow you out of the room and it won't cause any trouble. The truth is inside. The truth is inside.
Thanks, Mr. Krabs. Okay, so I'll be playing the next story. One more story. So, okay, kung sino man yan. And then I'll call it. I'll stop playing the game, then let's talk about something else. Uh, there's something different that I want to talk about. Pa. Hey, Kara, ata ata. Thank you for using Detroit buses. <gasps> okay, so good. We're back to Kara, guys. All right, Kara on the run. End of the line. End of the line. Yeah, you're gonna have to leave. Let's go, Alice. Wake up. Let's go. 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 Wow, wow. Alam mong distressed talaga yung bata nito for such a long time. Uh. Okay, so we need to find shelter for the night, I guess. Oh, fuck. Yan ang labig siya. Magkakasakit siya. We'll find somewhere to spend the night. Let's go. Let's not die. Come on, Alice. We've got to hurry. Kailangan natin bilisan bago tayo mauli. Kung may heater function si Kara, grabe naman. Alice! Uy! San ka? Come back! Uy, wag kang paligoy-ligoy lang. Where are you going, girl? Uy, san ka papunta? Wait, wait, wait. San ka papunta? Oh, sorry, wait. Sige, maghahanap na ako. Alice, you're freezing cold. I'm okay. I'm not so cold. Oh, nagsalita na siya. You look lost. We have nowhere to go. I know someone who can help you. But that's on the other side of town. We need a place for tonight. Crazy. Wait, Alice, sorry, ah. Mabagal ako maghanap. Thank you for using Detroit buses. Oh my god. Sorry, Alice. Wait, saan ba ako punta? Do I go... Oh. Pwede ako pumunta sa store. Ayan, let's go sa store para magpatuyo muna tayo. Look, the store is still open. Maybe we should go inside. At least you'll be out of the cold. Ano nga natin kung may kape tayo dito? Okay. Pwede ba ako kumain? 
chocolate, food for Alice, chocolate. Uh, fuck. Shit, magkakasakit ka dito, Alice. Aircon to, no? Ayun, sige, Alice na tayo. Magkakasakit ka dito. Tara. Come. Come. Alice, hold my hand. Magkakasakit ka dyan. Tayo dyan. Wait, so may prompt tayo dito, di ba? Try natin. Nakakainit ba ang chocolate? Okay, so I think yung goal, if you're a fugitive, ayaw mong malaman ng mga tao where you've been. So mali ko na napumasok ako ng convenience store kasi nakita na ako sa cameras dun. If I were a fugitive, Gusto kong hindi ako nakikita sa mga cameras ever. So, dapat, dito tayo sa abandoned car. Don't you think? He looks abandoned. Unlock the car. Ah, uh, break. Ano kong mag-alarm? Nope, nope. An abandoned house. At least we'd be out of the rain. Kara, I don't like this place. I know. Sure. But it's just for one night and no one will look for us here. I agree. I agree. Mashadong, 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 mashadong obvious yung kotse. Kung ibasa ko yung ano, maririnig ng mga tao. Impossible. Walang tao yan. Abandoned naman eh. I, I believe in Kara's gut. Yan. Kung may tao man, edi kaibigan, na, kaibigan din natin. Siguro naman fugitive din yun. Grabe naman. Ang hirap naman ito. Are you alright? Ouch. Yes, it's just a scratch. Be careful. Yeah, Thomas is Stephen. Women's instincts don't apply. Don't worry, we're just having a look. Yeah, so makinig muna tayo kay Kara. I think she has something going on. Silong tayo, silong tayo. Huwag tayo magpaulan, girl. Oh, fuck. Uy, mag-iingay ka. Huwag mong kunin yan. Hello? Ano ba akong samilip? Oh, but Android siya. O nga naman. Well, totoo naman. Tama naman, DJ. If... Alice? Android nga siya. Alice! My God, Alice! Oh, where are you? Uh, oh, shit. Wait! What are you doing? Visitors. Raph doesn't like visitors. They're nasty. Oh, my God. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, little girl. She's just a little girl. She's not gonna hurt you. Little girl? Anyway, what does that matter? Maybe she wants to hurt Ralph. Holy shit. No, 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 no. I don't know what the humans did to you, but she had nothing to do with it. No, no, All no, humans no. want to hurt us. No, 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 shut up, shut up. But Ralph won't let them hurt him again. No, no he won't shut let up. Them. I'm an android too. Ralph, god damn it. You have nothing to be afraid of. Chill, Kalam, bro. All we want is a place to spend the night. Bro, chill, Kalam. These are dangerous. Look, what they did to Ralph. Yeah, lahat tayo na maltreat, ay, mistreat, bro. I'm on your side. Chill ka lang, chill ka lang, chill ka lang. You have nothing to worry about. We're not going to do you any harm. You have my word. Chill, bro. Jesus. 
You must excuse Ralph. Ralph still finds it difficult to control himself. Sometimes his fear makes him do things he regrets. Ralph has seen some hard times. God. Chill out, He's just bro. so scared the humans will get him again. You can stay if you want. Chill out. Ralph won't hurt you. Oh my God. Okay. Chill, We'll just bro. stay the night. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> okay, no, we, I'm, I'm, Come. I'm Come beginning on. to regret my decision. Baka dapat hindi ako... Baka dapat... Hmm... Hindi no, sure ka ba? Pwede pa pa tayo manis. Uh, let's bounce. Alas na tayo. I don't think safe dyan. Hello? Hello? Oh, fuck. Hindi na pala pwede. Okay, I hope... I hope hindi ka tayo i-regret. Hindi, okay lang. No, I trust Ralph. I trust Ralph. Baka, baka he's just a kid, you know? Naive tayo. We're naive. Let's play with our naivety. You can oh. make yourself at home here. Oh, Ralph is gonna go creep. into the other room. He would like to stay with you. Sovereign creep! But he has things to do. Sovereign creep! It's just for one night, Alice. We'll find a better place uh, tomorrow. Oh, one night, one night, just one night, just one night. Right. Whew. Let's see where you can sleep. One night long, one night. One night Sit long, one night Sit down and I'll start a fire. I'm not going to so I can keep you safe. Make bed for Alice, okay. Can I scan? Okay, so I'm going to scan it. Whatever this is. Uh, na natin yon. Kunin na natin lahat ng pwede natin kunin. Newspapers. Sige, kunin na natin yan. Kunin na rin natin to. Lahat ng pwede natin kunin. Kunin na natin. Siya ang dumi siguro yun. Oh, nawala yung phone. Wala, nawala yung camera ko. Wait lang, bakit yun na? Ah, hello. <laughs> okay. Yan. Okay. So, lagyan na natin yung... newspaper. Fire muna para mainitan. Yes. Ay, well, good. Diba may nakuha ko match kanina? Fire. Paano ba? Hello? Ah, ba tayo? Collect wood. Oh my god, may kahoy pa pala. Gano kahaba to? It's around 9 hours, but this is the last scene that I'll do. For tonight. Hari 9. What does that mean? What? Those symbols. Why are you writing that? I don't know. I don't know. Well, I'll surprise you guys with the next topic. Uh, it would. Okay, lang hours na tayo. We started at 9, so we're 2 hours in. Let's go, Kara. The mask and a girl. Ah, ba dito? No, isn't that wood? Ay, wala. Room. Uy. Okay, so send back up and back. I need wood. Hi, Erica. Sorry, I'm not going to be. Yeah, no, I finally. 
Pareil. Pareil. I think that was a tire. Please. That was not. I didn't have a choice. You can come to bed. Mm -hmm. I did what I could. It's not much, but at least you'll be warm. Okay, perfect. Wait, look at it. Set up for the day. Set up for the Why didn't he ever love me? Why was he always so upset with me? All I wanted was a life like other girls. It's not your fault. Maybe I did something wrong. Maybe I wasn't good enough. You are good enough. That's why he was always so angry. Hey, naka drugs lang siya. I just wanted us to be a family. I just wanted him to love me. Can we just be happy? I don't know, Alice. You'll never leave me, right? No, I, I promise won't. you'll never go. I promise. I promise. Will we be together forever? Yes. Forever. Forever. Tapos mamatay si Caro. <laughs> Sobrang sad. Oh my god. Sobrang devastated siguro ni Alice kapag nawala na si Caro. I miss ko na rin yung feeling ng may kakadel sa tabi tayo. Gusto ko rin ang kayakap pag matulog. <laughs> Joke lang! Secret! Wala akong sinabi! <laughs> Wala akong sinabi! <laughs> ang sakit! <laughs> Gusto ko rin ang kasama ko tulog. <laughs> ang tagal na! <laughs> Joke na! <laughs> okay, sige. No, let's end it there. I think we've two hours is enough. Uh, if you guys want me to continue this, uh, I don't know when ko itutuloy. But I want you guys to see the whole thing. Ang ganda niya talaga. Promise. It gets a lot more intense. Bukas, uh, sige. Uh, probably do it on, ano ba ngayon? Wednesday? Friday. Friday night? Maybe. But I want to get other topics in then, guys. Oh, oh, sorry, sorry. Okay na to, okay na to. So, let's get back. Okay, sige, sige. Uh, let is quit this. So there's this another... Ah, so there's this other, I know, there's this other topic that I wanted to Cyber talk Life, about. the company that manufactured me, is conducting a user survey. Would you like to participate? Uh, yes. Alright, so there's another topic that I wanted to talk about tonight. Not related naman din sa Beyond Human. Well, Become Human, Detroit. Yung game kanina. So there's this other, I know, there are other theories kasi when it comes to what makes humans human. There's this, I know, there's this other story that I wanted to know, talk about, and it's called Soma. I don't know if you guys have heard about it. Soma is another, it's another game, but it's way different from, it's way different from, it's way different from Detroit. That was the premise of it. Um, it's a few years into the future. Uh, that was there's this the main protagonist of the story. Um, 
finds herself uh, finds herself in an ano, undersea world kasi dahil sa global warming nalunod na lahat ng structures in society that's in the future so you're playing ano, you're going through the um, you're going through the underwater city tapos you find out na namatay na pala yung human race And the only way they preserved themselves was they uploaded themselves into this cloud. So parang nasa hard drive na sila. Lahat ng consciousness nila nasa hard drive na. And you figure out na you're just a person who was uploaded into a robot. So what I wanted to talk about is if ever na eradicate na nga ba ang human race and upload tayo sa conscious na upload tayo sa hard drive. So, yung hard drive na to, they were like... So, yung hard drive na to, it was sent to, to outer space in the hopes na mahanap siya ng aliens. Tapos, mabalik tayo into life. Pero in robots na, it will never be a human ano, species yet again. So, do you think yung hard drive robots ba na yun, na linagay mo lang yung conscientiousness, is the same as a human race do you think na we can still be humans in a different body like is it is it our bodies that make us human or is it our conscientiousness diba no hindi na God created us eh But God created everything else, diba? As long as my free will. Kasi yung inisip ko, if everything was just created under God, everything was created under God, but we were humans in the first place. So what separated us from the animals? Yeah, no, let's have a call. Let's have a call. So do you think pag ganun na in-upload yung tao sa isang hard drive tapos linagay lang sa isang robot Kunwari ako, kunwari ikaw inagay ka sa isang robot would you still consider yourself as a human being? Sige, I'll take calls, I'll take calls I wonder what you guys think We're in the future ah Let's put it into, ito yung context So we're in the future. Say off your kind music, but in the time it is here. But we're in the future, kasi. So we can preserve human consciousness perfectly. Okay. So we can preserve it perfectly. So we don't have to worry about kung hindi na siya human. Yung consciousness natin yung ano. Hey Jude. Hey, what's up? Hi. So. What do you think? Uh, yeah. Yung what do I think? So. Yeah. 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 Go ahead. Yung tingin ko lang naman sa kung it make us human pa ba parang feeling ko kasi hindi na kasi uh-huh. what makes human human <laughs> from yeah, the word okay. human from the root word human, human. yung yeah. pakikiramdam pakikiramdam saka other than that the senses it okay. re- it is really important kasi halimbawa masasabi mo pa ba hindi ko isip pero masasabi pa bang humanity yung tao pag hit- wala ka nang nararamdaman. Mm. It's like hindi hindi yeah, na siya yeah, nagco-coexist. Yeah, I, I get you. I get you. Yung pakikiramdam, right? That's a very fil- Filipino term, 'di ba? Yes. Yeah, pakikiramdam. I don't think there's there's any other dictionary word for it sa other languages. Pero ito, no no wrong answer sa. I just want to like flesh it out a lot deeper. What if yung aliens they were able to create a body for us na marunong makiramdam? Tapos linagay yung consciousness natin sa bodies na yun. Would it still be human or not? Una, that will be nice. <laughs> that will be nice for sure. Uh, pero, pero hindi I na guess, natin. Yes. I guess hindi natin kamuha. It's not gonna be in the likeness of what we see as human now. Though there are cons. Though I get naman. Pero may cons pa ba wala? Sabi natin yeah. na understand nila yung yung aliens understand nila yung concept of senses. Yeah. Siguro yes. It will recreate. Pero it's not will it will be never be the same. Ah, so Pero it's marilikari. basically not human. A new term of nor a new term of human. So I guess it's a different being entirely. 
Yeah, pretty much hybrid, right? Ba? <laughs> ba? Maybe. Yeah, maybe. So, kung wari na upload ka dun, tapos linagay ka sa bagong katawan niya, would you, would papayag ka bang hindi tawagin na human? Why not? I'm open for changes naman eh. Eh, ah, maybe, maybe because naman, the extinction yeah, gets gender the cost of the... Yeah. <laughs> yes, agree, agree. <laughs> Pero yeah, okay. So, you wouldn't mind. You wouldn't mind not being called human anymore. Absolutely. Kahit you're the same thing. You're, you think the same way. You feel the same way. You wouldn't mind. As long as you yes. have a different body. Yes, agree totally. Mm. No regrets. Mm, okay, so yeah, sure. Okay, yeah. I got you. I got you though. Yeah, yeah. So yun lang. <laughs> okay, yeah. All right, all right, all right. Okay. No, thanks yeah. for the call, man. Yeah. Na appreciate it. ko. We're fleshing it out a little bit better. Pero ta, sige, sige. Um, what would you call it though? Like, what would you call the new species? Species ba tawag sa atin? What would you call the new entity? Kung hindi man humans. Ah, uh, sistik talaga ako sa hybrid. Hybrid. So we meta humans. Wow. Meta-humans. Let's go this. Let's wow. go this. Meta humans. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sige, fine. All right, sige, sige. All right, thanks for the call, man. I appreciate yeah, it. Yeah, sure. Yeah, mutants. Sabi ni mutants. Carlo. Mutants. Yes. Yeah. Bye, si-, si Carlo katibog ba 'yan? Oh. <laughs> Shout out. <laughs> oh, ito, Erica. Ito tinatanong ni Erica, what makes us human ba? Aside from the feeling. Kung, what if we retain that? What if we retain that aspect of us? Tapos linipat tayo ng body. Wait, sorry? Paulit ng question? So, di ba sabi mo yung pakiramdam? Yeah. Kung wala na yun, hindi na tayo human. What if sa- nas... Yeah, what, go. Sa- go, go, go. Ano yung sasabihin mo? Sa akin, yes. Hindi, hindi na siya human eh. It's, it's the unique thing about human eh. Ako, all baby because sobrang inaaral ko ngayon yung ano yeah, 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 yeah. yung pakikikapo at pakikiramdam yeah it, yeah, yeah i got you but me. what if na copy natin yun sa hard drive perfectly human pa rin ba yun if we get translocated into another body oh that's wait lang wait na paisip ako ah <laughs> napaisip ako wait lang kunwari oh my god kunwari the aliens gave us a new body to live in tapos we kept all the traits of pagiging pakikiramdam, pakikip kapwa, literal, whatever we used to do before nagagawa natin ulit, but in a new body, humans pa ba sila, or no? Actually, why not? Pwede naman humans, pero like I said, it will never be the same. It will be yeah, the it new will normal. Yeah, it will never be the same. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, yeah, I agree though. It can, pwede naman siya maging term ng human. Di pa, mm-hmm. it, di, magsiguro magbabago na yung definition natin. What is human? Yeah, yeah, by yeah, then. yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yun. <laughs> oh, so I guess we're breaking into the what makes us human now is the totality of our being. Yes. So not just yung what's inside us. Pero kasi syempre, how we are as a person is reflected by both our physicality and our yung spirit natin and our con- consciousness. So yung entire thing na yun that constitutes us being human, right? Yes. Mm, okay, sige, no. All right, I got to, I got you a lot better. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay, sige. So yeah, let's sige. get some other people to call. Baka may yeah, sure. Sa- 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 sa. All right, sige, thanks you da. I sige. appreciated that. Sige. Yeah, okay. Sige. Bye. Bye 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 bye. All right, sige. So let's have another few calls. Um, ganon, ganon, Jude. I like that. I like that answer. There are no wrong answers. Na. I I agree with you guys 100%. I just want to be like the devil's advocate para lang makita natin yung ano, different sides of the coin. Because I don't think there's anyone disagreeing. Okay, sige. So, let's read some people. So, you're saying no to what I said a while ago. What if hindi sab- sinabi ng aliens na were new species created by them? Parang they made it clouded to us tapos we just refer to them as gods in the hopes that they preserve the line between superhumans and just humans. Hmm. Hmm. O nga, no? What if... What if yung mga taong pinagkuhanan ng... Ano nila? Consciousness. Hindi... Hindi sinabi sa kanila na in-upload sila somewhere. Parang yung protagonist in the story. Hindi naman siya sinabihan na... Ano eh? 
Hindi naman siya sinabihan na... Tawag ito? Hindi naman siya sinabihan na linipat siya ng katawan eh. He, honestly, he thought na he was human this whole time until he realized na he was just a robot. Tapos linagay lang yung being niya into the robot. What if ganun niya? What if hindi natin alam? Baka naman we'll think about ourselves as human all along this time until sabihan tayo ng alien. No? Bro, I'm literally doing cells right now, homework, so that here's my take. No, we cannot be called human when our consciousness is another body, etc. Because our organic body is part of our humanity. Maybe being human involves both the physical and unconscious aspects of what we are. Wala na ding genetic traces if ganun, kasi magiging data signature na lang tayo, so it won't validate our humanity. Mm. Oh, here's a question. So if that's the case, kunwari, let's scratch the consensusness away. What if I want to deal with, kunwari, na kahanap tayong few human cells. Let's say na extinguish yung buong human race. Tapos may aliens na nakapunta sa Earth, tapos nakita nila yung cells ng humans. Much like how we see yung mga cells ng animals when it comes to mga ice age. Tapos they plan to recreate us. Very much like how we plan to recreate human species before. Would you say na it's still the same? Or would it still be humans? No? What do you think? If we're going with the genetic traces line, humans pa rin ba yun? No na. But why not? If it literally came from our own cells, is it because nawala na yung human civilization? Is humanity defined by the things we create? Yeah, like, sinabi si Stephen, test you babies are human. So yeah, let's call PJ. Hey, PJ. Oh, nagre-ring ka pa. Hello? Hello, PJ? Hello, sorry, PJ. Medyo, ano, hindi kita marinig. Yeah, hello. Ay, yeah. yun. Okay, perfect. Sige. So, narinig no, ko na yung question ko eh. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Alright, sige. So, what do you think? Um, no din. Uh, Nag-agree ako dun sa mga sagot na nagko-comment. Yeah, alright. Care to explain? Pero kasi, kaya medyo nahihirapan tayo yung to think of it. Kasi parang, may certain <laughs> level of, ano lang, na, parang may, ano na yung, yung utak natin kasi parang kaya hindi na talaga natin masagot yung, sag- yung tanong na do uh-huh. may different perspective kasi tayo sa sa question mo yep. kasi for example like yung yung sa aliens syempre hindi naman tayo lahat naniniwala na may aliens yep, yep. so I think medyo mahihirapan tayo na sagutin kasi kailangan natin muna ng proofs na, may na meron na nag-i-exist talaga yung isang bagay yeah. mm-hmm. para kung halimbawa na ga, kung gagawa talaga siya ng halimbawa yung aliens kung kaya talaga nilang gumawa ng mm-hmm. parang human out of the cell or parang i-recreate ulit nila yung buong humanity mm-hmm. if that makes sense yep. okay <laughs> Ito, so, so dun, okay, go, go, go ahead. Ayun, dun, parang dun nagkakaroon ng, ng pagkakaiba sa, sa perspective natin. Yeah, yeah, Kasi, yeah. ang hirap talaga, parang ang hirap talagang, yan o eh, parang ang hirap. Hirap isipin. That's isipin. Sure. Yeah. Kasi, ano eh, hindi din naman natin alam kung may exist talaga ng aliens. Yeah, but uh, under the pretense na, uh, what if aliens did exist? Sige, punta tayo dun. What if aliens did exist? Alisin na natin yung, ano, yung alien. Let's talk about yung, the human aspect of it. 
So, going back to yung conversation kanina. So, parang, di ba, uh, genetics, blah, 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 traces, clones. So, i- yung mangyayari, magkakaroon tayo na perfect replication of a human body. That, is that still human? Parang kasi kung hindi na tayo yun, parang hindi na din. Hindi na talaga. Hindi na talaga. So, you think na... What makes us human is not just yung physical aspects and yung capab- capabilities ng thinking, capabilities ng feeling, pero yung civilization as a whole. Yung experiences ng human civilization, that makes us human. Um, oh, parang ganun. Pero kasi parang, ano kasi, nag-ano kasi, parang nag-alaban ngayon sa isip ko yung about si study ng creation and evolution. Ah. Mas maano so, ba? <laughs> evolution ka ba o creation? Eh, hindi. Parang if we're going to think sa evolution... Sige, discuss mo lang. Go lang. Go lang. Wala naman mali. Oh, oh, parang may isip natin yung... May isip natin yung sagot as yes. Human pa rin siya kasi mas pinaniniwala natin yung evolution. Kasi sa evolution, di ba, merong mga... Yung about macro evolution, yung yeah, natural yeah, selection, yeah. wherein nakaka-create ng bagong species out of something. Mm-hmm. Ganun. Kaya kung, panini- kung yun yung paniniwalaan mo, kung mas parang mas inclined ka dun sa ganung paniniwala, isipin mo talaga na human ba rin yung lalabas out of dun sa kinreate na bagong species. Yeah, based on scientific, ano, diba? Ah, oh, parang ganoon. Yeah. Pero kung sa creation tayo be based, parang hindi na, hindi ta, hindi yeah, siya magiging. Kasi, 'di ba, what made us human if it's in terms of creation yung ano, that we were born under the like the ano yan, under the likeness of God, 'di ba? Mm, ganoon. So yeah, if yeah. hindi na siya on, sa kagustuhan ni God, hindi na siya human, 'di ba? Oh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, okay, yeah. Kaya, ano yun, parang, ano yun, parang... Yeah, I get that. I really get that. Creation versus evolution. Kung yeah. yun yung pagpapasihan mo, dun sa dalawang yun, talagang magkaibang point of view. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Yun lang ako. <laughs> no, yeah, no, that was really nice. Pero interesting kasi yung topic, kaya gusto ko ding mag-interrupt. Yeah, 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 no. I like the topic also. Pero I like, I like more what you said. Kasi mas... Mas malinaw na yung approach natin when it comes to the creation theory na what makes us human is because God made us. In, yan, yeah, because God made us as humans in His likeness. Diba? Oo. Uh, yeah, nice. Okay. Parang yun yung talaga yung point. It's yeah, that, versus yeah, how, yeah, yeah, that's the point. Yeah. So ano yung pinaniniwalaan natin if it's if we are more inclined to na naniniwala tayo sa evolution or sa creation, yeah. mas ano, parang dun babase yung sagot natin dun sa, sa yeah. dinidiscuss natin eh. Yeah. I, got, I, got, I like it, I like it. Thanks, sige, sige, thanks PJ. So, let's have a few more calls. I like that, I like that. Alright, sige. So, I like that answer from PJ. Uh, so, we have the creation theory on the way. Hmm. Pero not everybody believes in kane eh, in the creation theory. Not everyone's Catholic. So iba iba pa yung theories natin dun sa when it comes to religious aspects of it. Sige, so let's go away from religious. Kasi na solve na natin what makes us human when it comes to um, creator theories. So if there's a God, we were created as humans as a God. Hey, as a God, we were created as humans because of the God who created us. I like it. Sige, ito. Uh, I have ito another question. Pero medyo mas metaphysics na to when it comes to the line of thinking. I want us to ride yung idea na sige, let's have yung consciousness was uploaded into the ether. Tapos linagay siya sa different body. So my question is, there's a possibility kasi na one person is uploaded into two bodies. So do you think 
yung premise na yun, you would have the exact same person. Or no? What do you guys think? Like, there were two kinos na linagay sa two different... Ay, one... Oh, linagay into two different bodies. Do you think... Do you think, ano? Do you think I would be the same person? Parang clone kami? Or hindi? Like, we would understand that we are different people even if we know we are both kino. Okay, no, no, no. I'm getting no's, but why? No, but ito yung ano eh, ito yung premise eh, na me, whoever I am, whatever I'm thinking, nilagay mo sa isang USB. Sige, lagay natin sa USB. So yung USB na yun, sinaksak into two different bodies. Copy-paste. Would I be the same person twice? Same everything. Would I be the same person twice? Tas nakita kami. What do you think? Initially, yes. No, because both person experience different things simultaneously. Same environment pa. You're on the same testing table ng alien ship nila. Yun yung premise. You're going through the exact same thing at the moment. Do I exist as two people twice? Hindi, hindi talaga nature-nurture. Back at the sort same, tapos magda-diverge sila to two different people. Kasi ikaw lang si Kino na malaksan mo yan, Erika. What's on your mind ba? No, no, no. I want you guys to call me and explain bakit no. Or bakit yes. Would I be making the same decisions ba based on my free will? Hi, Tin. Hi, Kino. Yes, hi. Good evening. Sige, what do you think? Hi, good evening. Uh, I think hindi na eh, kasi... Oh, yeah, okay. Uh, uh, so, sorry, hindi ka ta masyado marinig. Ah, hindi. Go, go, go. Yeah. Ay, narinig mo na ako. Ah, uh, narinig, narinig na kita. Alright, anyway, sige, alright. I think kung yung consciousness mo kasi, eh, sipapasok siya sa, let's say, dalawang bodies, no? But same mm-hmm. consciousness. Hindi eh. Hindi yun hindi. magiging... Alright, but why? Because... No, because what makes you human is your um individuality, mm-hmm. your being unique. Mm-hmm. So kung pasok mo siya sa dalawang uh, dalawang body, magiiba kasi yun eh. Magiging program na lang siya. Mm-hmm. So, um, mm-hmm. dahil program uh, So, are you trying to say as soon as in-upload tayo into the two different bodies, we're different people na? Yeah, basically, cause pag conscious as mo, wala na yun eh. Limited oh, okay. na yun eh. Do right, not yep. yun eh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got it, I got it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so, sorry, ang hina nung signal eh. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I got it, I got it. Yeah. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> yun. Mm, okay, okay. <laughs> At saka, ano ba? So, it's sorry, not possible ta- for two kinos to exist. Four? So, no, kung no, no. sino man yun, May isang kino at may isang di kino, basically. Kahit same person ka yeah. na pinanggalit. Yeah, doon na, pa- yeah, do na papasok yung ano. Uh, uh, alright, alright. Yeah, okay, alright. Ah, uh, uh, yun lang. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. Sige, okay. thank you. Sige, thanks, thanks, thanks. <laughs> thanks, then. So, we have another caller, si Jerome. Say, so, let's call Jerome. Sorry, binabaan kita kanina kasi Tin was still calling. Oops. Jerome, tawag ka ulit. If nandito ka pa, tawag ka ulit. Ano ang skin care ko? Uh, hydration, tulog, etc. <laughs> Wala akong skin care. Uh, kung hindi mo lang nakikita, uh, marami akong pimple. As in, sobrang dami. Hindi lang kita on camera. As in, sobrang dami. As in, sobrang dami. Ang pangit, ang pangit. Ang pangit talaga. Ang lalaki ng pimple ko. Hello, Z. Z, 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 Z. Yeah. Alright, hey, Z. So, narinig mo naman yung conversation natin on the podcast, right? So, what do you think? Mm. Kasi pag ano, iano ko siya as ano, di ba? Sabi parang eksperimento, di ba? Yep. So, yung question is if 
kinapipaste mo yung sarili mo tapos yun ano. Mm-hmm. Di ba? From ano, ibibase ko na lang kung experiment siya. Kasi di ba pag sa program, sa computer, pag kinapipaste mo kasi same thing pa rin yun eh. Yung mangyayari. Ah. So, possible na madoble pa rin. Kasi kung ano yung yung kung ano yung original na pinagkopyahan tas mm. so ito yun yung yun, parang copy paste basically oo uh, yun yun yun, yun na ti yun pa rin so wala naman kasi binago eh mm. so yun, kailan sila yun, magiging ba when do you think they'll change i think ano pag magkahiwalay na sila naka-experience sa isang bagay ah so ito na yung, yung nature nurture so whatever yung uh, experiences uh, ng isa doon na sila magkaiba ako, ako naniniwala pa rin all kasi uh, di ba Mm-hmm. Like, sabi ko nga, before I was a diba, nagturo ako, tapos yep. nag, pinag-aralan na may mga human behavior, mm-hmm. especially sa mga bata, yeah. yung ni- nature versus nurture. Sa akin, at, at the end of the day, choice pa rin talaga ng individual human being kung paano sila matututo or makikisang ayon sa, napal- sa paligid nila. Kasi kahit, for example, yeah, because, tinutu- yeah, tinuturuan ka sa bahay na maging mabuting bata. Pero choice mo maging gago. So, walang 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 ano effect pa rin yung ano. Kahit naman like sabihin, 'di ba? Huwag kang gum- like, for example, yung mga magulang natin, huwag kang bumarkada sa mga 'yan kasi natut- natututo ang ganoon. Eh, at the end of the day, choice pa rin ng bata kung magiging ganoon siya or hindi, 'di ba? Yeah, parang yeah. sa parang sa, sa sa sarili pa rin tayo di depende. Mm, yeah, yeah, yung, yeah. Ano ko, yeah, no, yung, I, I, I agree with that, ano, with that aspect. Kasi, mm. uh, kasi kaya mo ilagay yung bata eh, for example. Yeah, no, kung bukal human, na talaga yeah, sa yeah. kanyang, kung bukal na talaga sa kanyang good person siya, and choice niya maging mabuting tao. Kahit saan mo siya ilugar eh, kahit sa lugar na puro masasama yung vibes, like parang hindi no, ganito. I, I, I think ano, iba lang kasi yung ano eh, people are receptive naman to learning. It's just that kung hindi mm. mo nakuha yung tamang form or approach, hindi mo talaga may yeah. iba yung choice niya. No? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yun nga yun. Nature versus Kasi, nature, yeah. Oo, parang mag-hold on ka na lang kung sino ka talaga. Kasi yeah, choice yeah, mo maging ganun. Yeah, whatever, diba? whatever yung nangingibabaw lang talaga. Pero mm-hmm. it's still a mix of both, I believe. No? Hmm, parang yeah. ganyan. Tama. Yeah. So, yeah. yun lang. Share ko lang yung sa ano, yung, yun, yun sa tanong mo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so, thank you. No, thanks, thanks. Thanks for that. All right, have a good night. Okay, so yun yung sinabi ni Zay. So ito, interesting, by Black Enigma. So against what Zay was saying, in programming kasi, you're basically creating two different instances of the same object, but they don't share the same properties. Which is true. Kasi even if you copy-paste two things, they're not the same thing. They're two objects. Gets ba? Kasi when you look at, kunwari, nagpo-photoshop ka, tapos you copy one object on another object, You create two instances, but they're never gonna be one. Yeah, no, I get that one. Yeah. I think nothing exists at the same time since time only moves forward. Hence, in this universe, there can only be one key, you know? Even if there are two completely same thing, they occupy different spaces. Yeah, no, right. So, dito pumapasok yung metaphysics aspect of it. Meaning na... Is it justifiable that since there are two of me of the same consciousness, does it mean we exist on the same planes? Parang ganun. Yeah, no, ganun talaga, ganun talaga. Pabroad, pabroad talaga yung topic. Hmm, interesting, interesting, interesting. Ah. Ito, so, okay. Uh, so, going from that, going from the whole consciousness thing, Consciousness thing, yung duplicates, clones, whatever, whatever. Ayat ay next question ko. So in the end, after we've collated that, and whatever yung mga metaphysics natin, whatever things like that, do you still think na at the moment we can consider ourselves as yung humans? Parang Is this really all there is to our humanity? From what we've dis- discussed, parang is this all that makes us human? Or is, this the, is there still more? 
na whatever makes us human now, yun na yun, yun at yun na yun. Never na in the future na kunwari magkaroon ng bagong evolutionary trait tayo, hindi na yun magiging human. Eh, do you get where I'm going for? What I'm trying to say? Na parang, what if we evolve in the future? Human pa rin ba yun? Or is it because now, whatever we are now, it's what makes us human? Yeah, like the definition of human is limited to what we are now. Because if we're going to go with the pretense that humanity is based on our physicality, is based on our consciousness, is based on our civilization at the moment, is that what we are now? Or if we have evolutions farther down, we have fins or whatever, we have tentacles, human are we human? What if it changed the way we lived? What if, what if, what we, what if hindi na natin kailangan kumain? Is that still human? Yeah, parang kapag nag-evolve ba si Pikachu, Pikachu pa rin ba siya kung naging Raichu na siya? Or kung yung Charmander, Charmander pa rin ba siya kung naging Char- Charizard na siya? So, are we human based on the definition we have now of what humanity is, what we've experienced so far, or may chance pa magbaga yung definition ng humanity? Kasi if may chance pa magbaga yung definition ng humanity... No, but you see, you have to understand. Human, humans, hindi naman yan, ano eh. it's not a type of species. Eh. Humans, our species is homo sapiens, pero... What constitutes us as humans is yun yung sinabi niyo kanina, yung, yung experiences natin as a whole, yung, yung consciousness natin, yung pakikiramdam natin, yung pakikipagkapwa natin, how we look right now since um, we already discarded the thought na we aren't human if we were interjected into a different being. So what if we evolved into something else? Do you think, still think human pa rin yun? So we're still the same creature, pero iba lang yung tawag sa atin. So we're not human. Or are we human? Yes, we're still humans. Just, we look differently. Ganon? Mm. So, pwede pa rin yung iniisip ko na if in linagay tayo sa different body, <laughs> the joke lang. <laughs> Yan lang naman yung ina-argue ko eh. Kasi, then, don't you think what makes us human is not really the physical aspect? Kung mag-evolve man tayo to live underwater, magka-gills man tayo. Then I still think, baka pwede pa rin tayo maging human when it comes to a different body na linagay lang. What do you guys think? Yung definitions natin of humanity restricted to social constructs, we need to think beyond that. Pero ang hirap kasi when you ano, eh, mix so- social constructs with scientific constructs na we we created ano, eh, social constructs. But like I said, walang wrong answer. Walang wrong answer. Walang wrong answer. I think I agree with Stephen that there are too many definitions and vary talaga yung ano, what we constitute as the what what is uh what a human is. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty hard to argue if you can't define what a human. So let's go back to the question. What is yung human? What is a human, di ba? Parang, if you think about it, it's so interesting, no? 2000, how many years have passed? Nung magpas na tayo kay Jesus, we have all these technological advancements, pero, hirap pa rin tayo to define what a human is. 
Would, don't you think na nagkakaroon na tayo ng mga super technological advancements? Yung term ng human, madedefine na natin. Kasi what if may dumating na different species? How would we explain ourselves to them? What are we as a human race? Paano mo i-explain yun sa kanila? No? What, what, what differentiated us from yung animals? Is it because we can talk? Kaya natin nabigyan natin sarili natin ng pangalan? Is it because we're self-aware? <laughs> According sa CAPTCHA, pick pictures with the stoplight to know if you are human. People is a collective noun, so it refers to more than one person. Human is a descriptive adjective or noun. As a noun, it refers to one human being. Humans is a descriptive adjective or noun. So when is it appropriate to call someone a human? I think yun lang talaga eh. Until masagot natin yung fundamental question na, so when is it right to call something a human? Hindi talaga natin masasagot yung question na, are we still human if we have different bodies? Di pa kayo naiinis na walang ano, wala pang definition ng human na solid na ano. Is it just all fabrications of the mind? Hindi yun yun natatakot ako. Eh. What if what if everything was just a fabrication of our mind? Na we set ourselves apart just because we can. Just because we have self-thought. Na nakakapag-isip tayo to a higher degree than other beings. No, guys, let's flesh it out. Someone give me a call. Earl! Earl, tumawa ka. Yeah, sige. Anyone, anyone can call. Anyone can call. Oh, so some have people who don't know how to call, by the way, who just joined me. All you have to do is add me on Facebook. So ito yung Facebook URL ko. www.fb.com slash Kino... Ano nga ba yung ano ko? Kino Polo 30. So, yan. All you have to do is add that, add me here, and then you can call me, and then you can tell me what you think. Sige, tawagin natin ito. Call tayo kay Carl. Since sabi niya, call. Ayan, si Carlo. Sabi niya, gusto niya tumawag. Here you go, Carlo. What do you think? Hindi. Para kasi ang naging question natin, di ba, is, ano, nag, naghahanap tayo ng concrete definition of human. Mm-hmm. I think ano? we're on that question now, yeah. Pero kasi ang question dito is, um, depende sa school of thought na gusto natin gawing absolute truth, which is, pwedeng may scientifically, pwedeng uh, mm-hmm. philosophically, merong meaning ang human, pwedeng mm-hmm. biologically, mm-hmm. or pwedeng biblically, biblically merong, um, Meaning ng human, pero kasi kung baga, uh, Is there no right ta- answer for all schools of thought na masasatisfy niya lahat ng <laughs> schools of pero thought, ako, do you think? Sa akin kasi yung pinaka-pinangahawakan ko talaga, doon, is yung, uh, uh, yung biblical reference natin. Kasi di ba, uh, ah. for me kasi, uh, we are a tripartite being. So yung sinasabi niya na we can copy the cells and the consciousness of tao, mm-hmm. yung dalawang partite being na natao, yung nakukuha natin. Pero yung mm-hmm. spirit of God, na meron yung tao. Mm. Yan, yeah, hindi mo talaga. Yan. Yeah. Ano kung pinasbasa ni God yung bagong species with the human qualities? Na <laughs> joke lang. <laughs> biro lang, biro lang. <laughs> Pero yan, yeah, no, it's... If you want... Yeah, no, no. It's easy to define a human when it comes to the religious aspect. Kasi hindi mo na talaga yun ma, ano, ma-change. That we were created as humans because of the likeness of God. Yeah, I understand that. Pero wala bang, ano ba, definition tayo na magagamit na both would satisfy this definition na we created in the likeness of God na mas-shoot mas sa ibang schools of thought. 
na we could actually create one solid definition of what constitutes a human being? Siguro, masasabi ko we are more selfless and sacrificial. Uh-huh. Parang, yes, uh, we can say na yung mga hayop uh, can somehow display that uh, those traits. Pero, yeah, yung mga feelings pero natin. I think tao, ta- tao pa rin talaga yung pinaka-selfless and sacrificial na yep. being na, na makikita mo. And, and there's so many things na na uniquely talaga makikita mo lang sa human. And if you see na parang magka-copy ka ng consciousness and ng cell ng isang tao to duplicate it. So, for example, uh, 12 years old yung nireplicate mo na tao and uh, doon na natatapos yun. So, y- so yung nareplicate mo, 12 years old lang siya and mag-grow siya ng sarili niya. Pero yung 12 years old na nareplicate mo, mag-grow din siya into another path. So, kahit isa din natin copy-paste yung mangyayari, they'll both uh, Napapaisip tuloy ako na parang ano kang possible nga mag-replicate ng isang tao? Tapos if we're working under the school of thought na they were created naturally, hindi na ba siya human? But they discriminate <laughs> kaya siya in that way? Just because hindi siya na-create normally? I think. Kasi parang inisip ko, is it being born naturally? Does that constitute you as being born sa likeness of God? What do you think? I think, oh, ganun. Mm-hmm. Parang kasing, di ba nga, uh, biblika yun. Um, and there's a proper way of reproducing. So ano kung naniniwala siya kay God? <laughs> the joke lang, well, man. Kayo, <laughs> Lemon, kayo, kayo. Kayo. joke lang yun. <laughs> all, all biro lang, man. Biro lang. So, wala. Kahit saan man tayo mag- Wala, na wala camera ko. Parang ko lang yan. Go ahead, go ahead. <laughs> yeah, lang, para sa akin. Pero, wala, we can argue and talk about this. Yeah, again. no, yeah, Pero, no. Wala namang mali talaga. Hindi talaga matatapos. Oh, hindi talaga, talaga siya matatapos because there's really no wrong answer. Pero at least, mas maliwanagan lang tayo in the different schools of thought. Parang yun naman talaga yung gusto ko mangyari. Na yeah. we could flesh it out a lot deeper and a lot better. Kasi maybe someday, we might actually find a good answer for what defines a human. Mm-hmm. Pero hindi naman mangyayari yun until people start talking about it. Kasi, hindi, I don't know. I don't know if as a species we're content na wala talagang concrete definition ng human beings. Or is it because natatakot tayo to clash on different schools of thought? Yes. Yeah. Pero at the end of the day, at some point, don't you think it's necessary na magkaroon tayo ng isang solid definition? Or hindi talaga para necessary. Kasing, ano, eh. It will never para be kasing, necessary. Ang hirap, ng, ano, ang hirap i-solidify ng definition natin kung tayo is patuloy na nagbabago and nag-evolve din as a person. So hindi natin pwedeng ilak. Parang kasi ang, ang hirap kasi niya, parang pwede natin siyang i- Mm-hmm. i-differentiate sa love. Parang nung bata tayo, yeah. mm-hmm. meron tayong ano, iba't ibang definition ng love. Pwede bang sabihin na ganito yung love, ganito yung love. Pero as we grow old, parang dun talaga natin. So I think, mm-hmm. masa, okay, yeah. parang yeah. feeling ko, feeling ko mga, yeah. madedefine natin yung pagiging tao talaga. If, yun nga, uh, nabuhay tayo as a uh, yeah. human for a long time. Mm-hmm. Parang, parang ganun. Ma- siguro, time. Time will... <laughs> Time will help us define what's human. Parang for yeah, yeah, yeah. So you're saying we don't need atin. to. We don't need to have a definition of human. Because for some reason, it's innate to us that we know that we're human. Get it? Why? 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 Diba? Parang, parang ganun. Parang diba yung nakakilapot? Na you complicated. get this feeling na alam mong human ka, pero hindi mo alam bakit. You just know. Yes. Whatever uh, definition pa yan. Yes, and one thing pa na madadagdag ko, siguro kaya, kaya ako, I, I hardly support uh, um, biblical reference. Kasi, mm-hmm. 
yung sobrang komplikado ng ta yung, yung pagiging sobrang komplikado natin in how special we are mm-hmm. is uh, hindi natin pwede ma na aksidente lang tayo eh. yeah yeah diba? yeah so yeah yun so sobrang sobrang mahirap talaga ng argue and yep. yeah, 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 yeah. I understand it's hard na naging yeah. aksi- na, na from one clash lang <laughs> na na form ng human and diba t- to think kung kung gano tayo ka specific and ka komplikado yep. Na, na create, diba? Yeah. Then, no, I agree. I agree. Inla. Alright, so yeah. <laughs> no, wait, no, no. It added to the no, conversation, yung deepness. Thanks, Carlo. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Alright. Have a good night. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. So I don't know if you guys are enjoying this, but I'm enjoying this so much, honestly. Yeah, no. You really need to sit down and talk to other people para lumawak yung understanding mo. I don't know if you guys are accelerated <laughs> or thrilled by the idea ng ganun. Pero ganda siya eh. Maganda, magandang exercise to. Uh, I hope uh, you guys get to practice this a lot more. Um, nakakatawa siya. And it's really for our... I oh, know it's really for our benefit na mangyari ta. But anyway, ah uh, ito. One last question since 12 AM na. Ito it's just really a chicken before egg question. A eh, chicken or the egg which came first question. Pero I just want to get your guys opinions on it. So since tapos na tayo with what makes us human, et cetera, et cetera. Tapos yung game na linaro natin kanina, yung Detroit, when it comes to morality, et cetera, et cetera. Do you guys think na morality is a fruit of us, of our humanity? Or is it, be- or does morality and yung ethical point of view define our humanity? So parang which came first lang talaga to. What do you guys think? There's no wrong answer, pero I really wanna flesh this one out kasi one huge aspect of our pagiging human is the morality aspect of us. So what do you guys think? Are we defined by our, are we defined as humans kasi we can make moral choices or is it because we're human that we can actually make moral choices? Ito, last, last, last question, and then we can call it a night. Pakit Tagalog naman, sorry, hindi ko kaya yun, men. Hindi ko nga alam anong Tagalog ng, uh, <laughs> ng ibang words na ginamit ko eh. Oh, words, no words. Hindi <laughs> ako magaling sa ganyan. Okay, let's see, Yuri, wow. Hi, good evening, Yuri. Welcome back. Hello. Hi, good good evening. Yeah, okay. Good evening. Okay, so Lalo did you hear na. the last question? Yeah, I did. Uh, okay, so what do you think? Oh, I'd like to think that we are uh, defined as humans because of our individuality, wherein uh-huh. our individuality encompasses the moral values and the morality of uh, our humanness. Ayun. So, kasi um, if I go back to the point na gusto ko lang balikan ng konti yung um, where we started as humans. Scientific yeah, go ahead. Basis, go ahead. Go ahead. Um, ikwento mo. Ikwento mo. Okay. Um, coming from a scientific background, yeah. um, we always we were always thought that everything starts because of something. My reason behind why uh, the Big Bang Theory started, why humans started as apes, and then we evolved. But um, our professors always, or hindi naman lahat, but ako, I'd always come to think na when science ends, then there comes God or a higher being na gumawa or nag ng ganong force yeah. to start everything. Be it uh, biblical yung pinapaniwalaan mo or uh, be it na hindi man biblical yung Diyos yung lumikha sa'yo but there is a strong force which caused everything yeah. to be in this mm-hmm. now we are forged by um, nature and at the same time um, by nurture 
which gives off our individuality. So, depende na lang yun sa ginalawan natin yeah. na environment kung ano yung magiging moral ethics natin. Mm, yeah. Kung ang isang bata ay privileged versus doon sa batang hindi privileged, then definitely, magkaiba yung pinaniniwala, yung pinapaniwalaan nilang moral values. Yeah. Diba? Um, doon mo may kita yung individuality ng tao, which hence defines na magkakaiba yung paniniwalaan nating um, definition ng pagiging human. Yeah. Diba? Yeah. Yung bata lumaki na underprivileged siya at ang pangahawakan niya ay yung moral values na pinalaki siya sa isa-isang um, Christianong pamilya, then mm-hmm. definitely, yun yung pangahawakan niya. Mm-hmm. Not yeah, unless yeah, yeah. he meets someone or something along the way or he experiences something na magpapaiba nung point of view niya or perspective niya sa life. Yeah. Ayun. So, I'm more on we are defined of our individuality kasi yeah. doon na nag encompass yung um, so pagiging... So, it's basically like yung, ano, eh, we became a product of the uh, mixture of the different morality um, ways of thinking of people. No? Oh, And we became a product of that. Oh, definitely. Where we are not where we are, kung hindi tayo sa lahat mula sa past, present, or in the future. Okay. All right. All right. Okay. Sige. Ah. Hmm. Na pa isip ako ah. Alam mo tip mo. Okay. Flash it out. No, I like that. I like that answer. So uh, really, that's one of the. Approaches so we can take the chicken and the egg. Well, for the chicken and egg, it will be the chicken which started because oh, you can't yeah. produce the egg without the um, substance coming from the chicken. Ako, talaga, like, pero kasi heavily defined yung ano eh, yung yung individuality natin on the experiences, no? Yes, and you can take that away. Kasi magiging, I mean, magiging ganun kang tao which makes yeah. you individual. Kasi dahil And may experiences. And the morality it, follows that makes us human. Ay, well, yes. yung morality that governs our human existence. Yes, and it will be different kasi magkakaiba tayo ng experience. So, hindi pwedeng ipilit ko yung pinaniniwalaan ko sa sa'yo. Yeah, yeah. Or ipipilit mo sa akin yung pinaniniwalaan ko uh-huh. ay pinaniniwalaan mo. But yeah. then again, we have our similarity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, kung yung question ay, is there um, definitive um, definition of what a human is, yep. then magkakaiba talaga tayo ng panggagalingan doon. They will debunk the scientific um, theory that I'm providing. Mm-hmm. They, I will debunk the biblical, although I'm not yeah. really de- yep. debunking everything. But you know, people come from different walks of life. So, we will really have a different perspective on things. Yep, yep. Mm-hmm. No, I agree. I really agree with that one. Uh, if I know, I couldn't put it into I know better words. Kung ganon yung yung argument, yeah. Ayun lang. Okay. <laughs> Kalo ko may ita dag dag ka pa. Pero sige, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Hello. Right. Thanks, thanks, Yuri, for the ano, the enlightenment. I enjoyed that one. Okay. All Thank right, you. sige. Okay. Bye. Have everyone. a good night. Bye bye. Yon. Okay, so that's one take on the are humans governed by yung morality nila or does morality is mo- morality governed by our humanity? So yun yung isang take na the individuality of the people which creates morality compasses, moral compasses in specific individuals. So yung intertwining nun kung whatever it is, that makes us human. I like it. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, since it's 12, I don't know if I can entertain other callers. But I really enjoyed this one. I really enjoyed the way we discussed. Actually, this was a more exciting part for me. Hearing from you guys. Um, hearing what you guys think. It really... It really... I don't know what the correct term it freshened. <laughs> Mas fresh yung outlook natin and how we approach things. Mas fresh yung reinvigorated, revitalized, nagbago um, the way of the way how we think about things. 
And I think dapat laging inquisitive yung approach natin. Na hindi lang tayo napapaniwala just because on the facts. Hindi lang tayo napapaniwala because other people said so. For me, I really think we really have to come oh, ano, uh, come with our own um, explanation to things. Tapos that's when we start discussing. Masaya yung mga ganito. Masaya yung mga ganito. And I hope na... Uh, yeah, I know. I'll think about other topics na pwede natin gawin. Uh, ito, Adriel messaged me. Nagpapabati ng happy birthday. So, happy birthday, Adriel. Uh, guys, bigyan na naman ng dab tong sa EGL. Boaz Agi... Wait, sorry. Aguilar. EGL Boaz Aguilar. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Pero yeah, uh, I'll think of other topics that we can discuss like this. Marami naman eh. Marami naman ganito. Um, next podcast ko would be on Saturday as well. Um... So you guys, I hope you guys are excited. Yung Detroit Beyond Human, probably not gonna do it as a podcast anymore since tapos na tayo sa topic na to. But I'll be doing standalone episodes for it so you can see what happens in the rest of the story if you guys are interested in that. Danes, happy birthday also. Uh, sino pa ba? Uh, yeah, happy birthday. Uh, and yeah. So I think that wraps up our podcast for tonight. Uh, sana natuwa kayo with the lively discussion. Oh, natuwa talaga ako with the lively discussion. Um, yeah, it's really good hearing different opinions, different viewpoints. And at the end of the day, wala naman kasi talaga yung wrong answer. And I hope you guys aren't shy to express your thoughts. Hindi naman kayo awayin eh. Well, Baka why get the joke lang. It depends on the topic. Kung ano siya, very... If it's not something na... No. If it goes against... Basta, depende. <laughs> depende sa topic. Um, kung nalalabag na yung mga karapatan natin, dun, huwag tayo, huwag tayo dun. <laughs> But anyway, sige. Um, tawag dito. Let's have another podcast sa Saturday. Um, I have a lot of other topics in mind. So yeah, uh, let's have the flood. Nyo naman ng dabs yung chat natin before we call it a night. Night guys, shout out ko kayo isa isa as we usually. Um, for everyone na nahiyan to mawag, okay yung mahiya, cause wala namang mga away sa inyo dito, promise. And it makes the discussion a lot, a lot more lively when I get to hear your voices. Lalo na sa mga very vocal sa chat. Yung mga lagi nagsasalita dyan na maraming opinion. So I hope you get the call. Kasi you'll be able to explain that a lot better if you're talking. So Libre naman yung Facebook call. Facebook naman kayo tatawag. Eh. Anyway, so have a good night guys. Uh, Joshua Avellino, Tony, Um, Albert Francisco, Earl, Erica, Black Enigma, Enigma Feliz Yuri, uh, Raymond Talon, Gabby De La Cruz, Carla Katibog, George Pasadas, Clarence Reyes, Joanne Montano, Ken, Tony Utakata, Steve Clemente, Albert Francisco, Rob Pastera, BJ Hernandez, Michael Pavia, Stanley, Kurt Romero, RKDY, Mia Avergonzado, Bunch Tamale. Have a good night, guys. Yeah, hope you guys enjoy this one. That was a little bit shorter than usual, pero mas gusto ko to. Mas gusto ko yung ganito. Yeah, I think we should keep this up. Uh, John Benjamin Sulit, G- Gerald Jr., Elves Derekito. Have a good night, guys. See you on Saturday for the next podcast. Kurt Lagando. Yeah, J- GJ Fahilian. Have a good night. PJ Javier, have a good night. Yeah, good night, guys. Good night. Good night, good night. So, yeah, so, yeah. alright. Have a good night, guys. Peace.